What's going on, everybody? Welcome into Scrub Central. Sorry for the delay. Uh, we were just getting some things set up on the back end. Welcome in, welcome in. Today we're featuring... Well, we actually have a double feature. Uh, two races uh, in two different uh, brackets are going to be raced at the same time using the same seed. Uh, we are featuring a group Nocturne match and a group uh, Requiem match as well. We have Kempachi versus Renata along the top half of the screen, as well as Dark Dylan versus Ven Corbin. Again, they'll be using the same seed. Uh, so it should be an interesting show. Uh, today on comms, I, we have Purple Rupees and Rogue Copter. They were kind enough to uh, join us today. Our trackers, Melqui, Goombill, Alexander Harold, and Goldfish are here as well. Goldfish pulling double duty is also a race mod for one of the races. And our other race moderator is Bitsy. And of course, I am Jimbo, your restreamer. I'm going to go ahead and hand it over to our commentators. Good luck. Have fun. Thank, Thank you, you very much, Jimbo. Hey, guys, gals, and non-binary pals. How's it going out there in Scrubs land today? We've got um, a, what is it, a uh, winner's bracket match in Nocturne and a lower bracket match in Requiem uh, for you today as well, right? Yep, that's what it says. And so, yeah, someone's going to be out and someone's going to be good moving on. So that's going to be an interesting one to watch, see if they play differently, make some riskier strategies, or maybe play safer, depending on if they know their opponent or not. Yeah, it's definitely with them playing the same seed. It's a different, uh, definitely a different mindset between the, uh, which I got to confirm which one's the winner's bracket and which one's the lower's bracket. But um, the winner's bracket one, obviously, you know that you still have a chance. If you lose this match, maybe you're going to take bigger swings, take bigger risks. Whereas in a lower bracket match, you might see him play the seed differently, a little more safer uh, to try and stay in the tournament. Yeah, absolutely. And it also looks that we've got, uh, I believe, let me check this. Is that Ocarina, the Song of Time? Yep, Song of Time is Time our start. uh, starting song. And we also, it's a medallion start. We start with the Spirit Medallion, and we will be starting as Child as well. Yeah. All right. So no immediate warp, so that can that'll be a little annoying, but at least we don't have to worry about Song of Time shenanigans. Yep, and we will see where our... Uh our uh, start is and uh, see where we all go from there. We're hoping for big divergence right out the gate. See all four of these people go somewhere different. Yeah. Ever since we introduced a random spawn, it op opens a bunch of opportunities for different routing possibilities. Hello there, Devin. Yeah, it does look like we need those uh, dungeon rewards set on stream. So hey there, Dare Devin, how you doing? <clears throat> On the stream uh, live, it looks like they're all filled in with somebody else's seed. Yeah, for what each medallion and stone is. Did that fix Should it? I haven't seen it change, no. It, it's on, on your share, it's changed, just not on the restream yet. Oh, uh, I see what you mean, I see what you mean. Chillin', vibin', maxin', relaxin'. All the while. Oh, we got ad percent. Oh. How close are... we get it now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> there we go. That's reset. Yeah, sorry about that. The browser source needed to be refreshed. For whatever reason, sometimes it doesn't refresh itself. So sorry about that. We got it figured out before the race started, so that's what matters.
So I'm interested if this is going to be a child spawn where the routing is obvious, like just starting Kokiri Forest and they just all do Deku right away. Or if it's just going to be something crazy like starting in Valley. Yeah, yeah. Fortress start or something ridiculous. Okay. I'm always a big a big fan of adult start in ZD. Oh, yeah. My favorite one was like coming in from Lake as adult into Domain. Yeah, you and rise then, up through the ice. And then clip through the ice. Oh, looks like the timer started and we are ready to go. All right. Good luck to all four of our runners. Hope they have a good time and hope they play to the best of their abilities. And let's hope the seed is uh, brutal, but in a funny way. So we're I'll starting in Kokiri Forest. Yeah. We got the nice sort of off-white, grayish tunic on uh, on Ven Corbin's side. Oh yeah, I really like that one. And dark uh, belt and with just vanilla. Looks vanilla, yeah. And we got a nice mint, to a couple of mint flavors up top with Kinpachi and Renata there. Oh All yeah. Right. So we get a, our first look at Mido's house. And it looks like we got a bow in uh, in Mido's house. <laughs> oh, so that's oh. an excellent start. We already found him. We already found Greg. Vanilla Greg? French vanilla oh, no. Greg? I don't even remember where Greg is in vanilla. I haven't played vanilla in years. <laughs> it's in the room. <laughs> yeah. All the runners look like they're going to go just do Kokiri's or chest right away. Understandable. Yep. We'll see if, uh, well, because now you know you're not going to see a uh, Kokiri Forest Foolish hint. Yeah. That's how I usually played back in season three was I would just do it right away if I didn't see a hint. I mean, I, if I found an item. Yep. And there's nothing in the in the sword chest. So we will see where everyone goes from here. I expect we do um, right into Deku and then the Lost Woods up to the up to the Saria song check. Or we could just do season three, go Lamon. Oh, sure. Do, do a do a. Yeah, because you can just yeah, and then just because you can reset back here. That is true. That might and then you know you'll reset. have time time a day to just make it to market if they want to go adult after they get all their songs. Yeah, absolutely. And but Ven, Ven Corbin looks like they are going uh, going to Deku, as is Renata, and Dark Dylan. Looks like we're all we're all going the same way here. Yeah, we're gonna see our first hints coming up very soon. All right, no okay. AD uh, uh, shenanigans, at least not for the song today. Yeah. Though, though I don't love seeing Prelude locked up. Yeah. It's, you, you, you're kind of hoping that Serenade is somewhere easy so you yeah. can uh, can do it quick with uh, with Child. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. You need some quick way to change between ages, and sometimes when you don't get any way to change between ages quickly, you just kind of got to stick with what you're doing. And 30 Skulls is dead. Ven Corbin doing a uh, an interesting strat. I'm used to going all the way around, but they've... Uh, They've decided to go counterclockwise there. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know that's like, it's harder and like marginally faster. It did look like they got it faster, yeah. Yeah, I think it's like, like it's one of those things that's like four seconds faster or something. It can add up. Yeah. All right, let's see what Deku has for us. We got some arrows in the first chest here. Gonna have a standard Deku. Um, wondering what kind of medallion or stone reward we're gonna get. You always love to see a forest medallion right here. Oh yeah. You just get your song right away when you go adult. Oh yeah, that's that's the best way to do it. Um, <clears throat> I uh, wonder if we're gonna get a variety of B1 skips, or if everyone's gonna do the same, the same thing. I guess without it depends if we find bombs or not. Yeah. Can always change them. <laughs> well, there's a free shield in case it burned in the last yeah. half minute. Oh boy. We got some shoes. Yeah. Alright. 
I always like finding at least something early because I'm always like nervous that it's just gonna be a foolish location and just like I'm gonna find Deku Tree. This is a foolish choice, like in Lost Woods and feel stupid. Yeah. Worst case scenario here would have been another bow, I think, because that would eliminate it as a foolish location, but you find nothing. <laughs> yeah. At least then I would know every single runner would be doing it as well. That is true. Just curious how uh, aggressive certain players are going to play skulls. Are we going to see, like, bow skulls? Well, this one you always get. Sometimes I skip the one in the basement when I just want to go fast. Yeah, same. Especially yeah. in scrubs. And they know... They already know they only need to do 10 and 20. Oh, and team never buy a shield has won the day. Yeah. Never even had to make that decision. Uh, Kenpachi's lagging a little behind everyone else at this point here. I'm not sure where the, uh, where the time loss was there. Uh, I'm not sure if they're streaming, because I think I saw them start, like, 10 seconds later on the restream. Oh, was it just that? Yeah, maybe. Not a significant amount, but enough to notice this early on. Generally, everything's going the same. All right. Let's hope all our players have a clean B1 skip today. Oh, interesting. Oh. What are you doing, Dylan? Hmm. I don't. Are they going to try to get the skull? I think like they might. Is there a way you can hop down to do? The I s I'm not sure. That wasn't going to be a B1 skip. Yes, it's uh, two 1v1s for two separate races. There's a Requiem winners and a Nocturne losers, or other way around, I forgot which. But they're two different races, just starting concurrently. But on the same seed, yes. Yes, same seed. It's Nocturne winners and Requiem lower. And Dark Dylan versus Ven Corbin is your Requiem lower uh, bracket match. <clears throat> Kinpachi versus Renata is your upper bracket. Um, okay, perfect. Yeah, in uh, in in Nocturne. Sorry about that, everybody. Unfortunately, there was no way for me to depict on stream like which group is which. So we're kind of just rolling with this. Unfortunately. Yeah. I'll go back and memorize it when all our players are doing Baron... Stone like, Forest. <laughs> Baron Medallion Forest, yeah. Yeah, everyone seems to have done a pretty clean B1 skip so far. We'll see. Yeah. We'll watch Kimpachi do it here now. Then Corbin breaking their stick. You get ready for Goma. We're going to get pretty synchronous Dekus here in our uh, lower <clears throat> lower bracket match. Yeah, this is literally just like the like margin of like error, like dreams and stuff. Oh no. Looks like we did not get a quick kill from either of our bottom players in the bottom portion of the restream. Dylan looks quite upset. And you can just see how much time that saves right off the bat. Yeah, absolutely. That's a uh, the the one cycle is important to uh, to get here. And Renata and Ven Corbin look like they've both pulled it off. Um, Kenpachi's struggling with the B one skip. Thank. You. I have those days sometimes. Oh, for sure. It looks like they've got it lined up here, though. This should work. There you go. And it is a vanilla Kokiri Emerald out of the Deku tree. I think your commentary is a little bit ahead. 
the restream. Unless my restream. I mean, if it is, someone in chat can tell, yell at you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, we're going to the Lost and, Woods as expected. Yep, yep, same old, same old. Let's see. Oh, actually, Renata is going into the field, which is funny because he's missed the Lost Woods Way of the Hero hint that we just saw. I always check that just in case it's foolish for that reason. Renata heading down to the open grotto. Oh, yeah. An interesting play. Good old see season three strats. More hints here. Yeah, Shay, season three strats. The uh, forest song for Sheik is Requiem. So... Oh boy. And the hammer in Lost Woods is probably Way of the Hero. Okay. You gotta love that one. It's like, it's Way of the Hero. Here it is. <laughs> And we're just hoping that's just for a fire medallion for us, yeah. not anything else. Yeah. Not like unhinted I valley watched. hammer rocks or something. <laughs> yeah. At least they'll have it on their first visit there as a doll. So if they go to GTG, they'll probably get it. We are going to see a valley lake play from Renata here as well. Okay. I don't think did, they didn't even go into the open grotto, did they? They just went straight across. I missed there. So that's a good point, uh, Melqu um, is that uh, the winner's bracket, we're seeing a more aggressive play here. Mm -hmm. Let's see if it pays off. This is a bold move, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Just a heart container in the crate. Mm -hmm. It always feels bad when you manage to route in Valley and you just don't get rewarded. I just like to get it out of the way. Yeah. It's really situational for me. Oh, were you able to check, see what the waterfall item was? I, was I didn't see it, it, no. He might have seen it. <laughs> <laughs> That's Valley Hammer is dead. In the bed, okay. Perfect. You know, ketchup I might this early too. <laughs> it's really interesting, we got three very similar routes going on. Oh, that's strength one in the valley. Oh, rewarded. At least that's something you can get as adult if you miss yeah. it as child. Now you're. Renata's kind of just hoping that it's not hinted by the yeah. hero, so the, oh, their opponents. Yeah. Or their opponent well, doesn't right. get it. He, he could care uh, less what uh, Dylan and Ven Corbin do. Yeah. An Epona's song is okay. in the sorriest spot. Oh boy, early GTG already in logic. My favorite. Yeah, <laughs> love to see it. I think that was bottom of ice or a fountain. Oh, that was King Zora. King Zora. Okay. I misread that one. Thanks for the correction. Oh, that's a great foolish hint. Oh, you love to see bottom of the well foolish. Yeah. This, yeah. this is a certified cat jam. Yeah. <laughs> so Renata can get rewarded with uh, child fishing as well. Early on. Let's see if they can do the quick fish. Yep, skull mask is also junk. That's also one you love to see. Y you hate when skull mask is bomb bag and then you do it and then immediately find bomb bag after. <laughs> in a non-bomb locked, just total yeah. waste of time. All 
All right, I let's see. Dark Dylan is going to be going. I would say it looks like adult, but I would assume they would do Lon Lon first. Looks like they're going to do... Uh... Child cat? Yeah, maybe chickens? I mean, that is kind of the, a play you would like to do in 1v1, because that can just make a seed for you. Yeah. Corbin's going to give us our first look at um, the ranch. And yeah, we are getting a chickens play here from Dylan. All right. At least we won't have to hypothesize over it for another two and a half Three hours. Three hours, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, we got a double chickens play going on. Right. <laughs> two, ver two varieties of chickens. So I like to say, always skip chickens, but only the one in Lon Lon. Oh. <laughs> That's, that is bold. I don't actually do that, but I like to say it. Yeah. It's funny to say. It's funny to meet her that. <laughs> yeah. Is it a wallet? Not bad. Makes money routing easier, and if that hammer is just for Fire Temple... Yeah, that's your more about how. access. Because that's one of the most annoying things, is you get early hammer, early fire access, but you have, like, no health or Goron Tunic. And it's this like... Is... Even if you're skilled, like, four or five hearts or whatever is not enough. No, it's not. You need... I don't feel comfortable without seven. Yeah. So, that was some pretty smooth uh, chicken wrangling for those first four. Chat just pointed out that we missed. We found 20 skulls as a hint of dead. Hint. Oh, okay. So that means we're at Ten most seeing skulls today. At this point, I might just, like, skip all skulls. <laughs> That's something I would do. And unless I saw a cat quaff. Yeah. Water boss key is junk. Oh, okay. Uh, magic on chickens? Uh, no, that was magic on, a. the grotto. Oh, the, the grotto, okay. Yeah, it was, wait a minute, he's carrying a chicken. <laughs> I always side. forget that you can enter that grotto without resetting it. Oh, and the silo has a bomb bag. Oh, that is a solid find. Yep. So what was the song? I missed the opponent, the opponent's song check. Uh, I did miss that either. Unless Jack he did help out with it. He goes straight. No, he's warping out. So it must have been a warp song. It was Minuet. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, so uh, Corbin going straight back to Way of the Hero Lost Woods with that bomb bag. Very sensible play. That makes sense to me. Hammer Wath with well, it, you know, maybe it's not. I mean, it could be to unlock something because yeah, you'd have to come back as an adult. Mm. But yeah, bomb sphere zero. Yeah. Yeah, and we know Valley Rocks is dead, so that's only really GTG key logic potentially. And I mean, there could be something greater. else in Lost Woods that is locked by a ham by by something you could access with the bomb bag. Yeah, that would eliminate the hammer wasp too. Yeah, or left maze. Yep, that's the other one. Yeah, it, it's strength, it would have to be, like, Strength 2 locked, though. Or, or Strength 2 would have to be locked behind it, I think. Yeah. Alright, SFM has some arrows. Renata doing perfect time of day to go into uh, the ranch just as daylight breaks. Sometimes I mess up and fail her up the sin early. Yeah, they can drop Deku Sticks if they're feeling nice. Such such a huge uh, ranch. You get the wallet, you get a bomb bag, and you get Minuet, which is a real nice routing song. Oh, oh and we got Hover Boots locked in the Lost Woods. Yeah, that's probably the way of the hero. Yeah, so it, could, uh, it might not be the hammer after all.
And when you're just eager to learn what the dungeons are. Yeah, that would definitely fill in the blanks a little bit here. I think Dark Dylan routed in Dampe here. I think they're gone. Yeah. Yeah, because they went up to trail to play to wait out time of day. Perfect. Okay. Spirit Temple is Way of the Hero. Okay. I actually like that one. Child Spirit is a play I like to make quite a bit. You have to go adult to get Requiem, though, in this scene. Yeah. But you, do, you will have it available yeah. pretty early, especially with Minuet. Mm hmm. And we're going to get a Child Goron City, or at least a partial Child Goron City. We can do one. We can do the Hot Rodder Goron. And the two uh, right side maze. Oh, we got a French vanilla hookshot sitting in the graveyard. Okay. This seed might be nice, or it might be the worst thing ever. It's going to be one of those. It's either going to be like really short or really long. I didn't peek the um the crate there. Uh, no, I missed that one as well. Corbin just getting a piece of heart from the Rolling Goron. Yeah, see, it's only 12% BS. Yeah, we should be fine. <laughs> okay. Oh, what was that item in the windmill? I didn't quite see it. Uh, the heart piece? Yeah, nothing worth grabbing, it looks like. Yeah. All right, we're going to see the um, the right side maze yeah. here. That's what Valley does is like sometimes it just pays off. I can't not do Valley when I play. Mm. I, I have a real tough time leaving it behind. Uh -huh. Like it's just causes me anxiety the whole seed. No, I'm the player. It's like, oh, I, I'm back walking to Valley two hours in. That's the kind of player. That I feels know. so bad. Oh, boy. So strength two is available before um before hammer. the hammer or in the same sphere as the hammer yeah ish what i'm saying is you don't need the hammer to get to the left side maze yeah so if it is way of the hero it's just for fire it's most or likely fire. fire yeah Those are the two most likely scenarios. Fire, DNC Fairy, or the one hammerlock check in GTG is like a key or something. The key logic in GTG is so mean. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna take a look at some of the Death Mountain trail here. Mm -hmm. Pretty dense area to go when you have bombs. Yep. I wonder who's gonna make the play to go adult first. I think but... Corbin might do it now. Yeah. Not much else to do as as uh, as child unless they were gonna do. Uh, they might be working in uh, Dompe here. Oh yeah, that. That makes sense. Excellent time of day routing going around yeah. for everyone here. That's, I think time of day routing is one of the more difficult aspects of randomizer. Especially when you're in situations where you're not quite sure how to route things. Like, you play Requiem early and then you're like, oh, do I have enough time for this? Winner heart piece. And Corbin could actually come close to 10 skulls yeah. already here. That's also nice where it's like you only need to do 10 skulls and then you just get it done right away and then you don't even have to think about them for the rest of the seed. Alright, Renata gets their hammer finally. They didn't pass anything hammer locked, so it's not like a big punish or anything. Let's see. Okay, Corbin is still going for skulls here, but they'll find their hook shot pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Dark Dylan about to go get their bomb bag. That momentary excitement of like, oh, oh shit, it's a bomb. Well, um, yeah. how do I get? Okay, all right, here we go. Oh yeah, there's a. You know when you're just autopiloting, like peeking and check, like oh it's gonna be nothing, and then it is something, and then you have to change your brain to like get it. <laughs> right. So your muscle memory wants to just like reset or just like start walking out a lawn lawn. That looks like nothing of value on Dampe. Now, uh, okay, there he goes. <clears throat> yeah, Dampe just had a piece of heart, but the hook shot uh, is their French vanilla in the graveyard and we're gonna peek the the crate again i missed it the first time okay just a piece of heart getting some pretty thorough child sections from all our players today but we still haven't hit the half hour mark so they're not spending too much time yeah yeah. No one's done a river play or tried to go into yeah, nothing wild. Uh, obviously, we don't have a scale or um, Zelda's lullaby or anything. It's just one of those things that you can see early on. It's just go adult super quick when you have an early bomb bag like that. It's true, but Zora's River does become a lot more tempting with yeah. an early bomb bag. It's true. I do. When but with I have hovers, I might do it. I might just do it as adult. Yeah. And they don't have storms, so... Right. No storms, no Rudo's letter turn. I think we are seeing a river play from... Yeah. Corbin. Maybe they want to buy some beans? <laughs> Get beans, pick up some more hints. But are we yep. going to also see a Out of Logic domain play? It could be. I mean... Why not, if you're gonna come this far- all the way up here? Yeah. Corbin not getting the skull in the river. I think they're at like eight or nine. But yes, a bean- a bean play is what we're getting. How many are they gonna buy? They got enough for his entire stock. <laughs> or enough that you would- could potentially ever need. But all it could potentially be, I guess, is, uh... Requiem area, Desert Colossus. Yep. Um, e even if it's something on the crater, you've got yeah. hovers already. Yeah. Yeah, Colossus is the only thing. Um, unless you really wanted to make Adult Lake quicker. Yeah. Like, I definitely buy a bean if I haven't found a hook shot yet, so I can do yeah. Adult Lake stuff if I have to, but uh, having the hook shot already oh, it no. seems redundant. We got oh, a death on a sculpture. Oh, that's... that feels bad. Yeah. I can't say I haven't done that, because I definitely have. It's true. Not a huge time loss, either. You can just yeah. wait right back up here. Yeah, you gotta stand way back. Oh, I see what they're doing. Yep, stand up top, kind of on the right. That's what works for me. Alright, let's see if there's anything in the river today. Nope, yeah. just a regular old wood shield. Another King Zora dead hint. Not even new info, come on. Reward the river play. Big shout outs to the Ice Cap Zone music from <laughs> Sonic 3 here. Yeah. It's always what? I play with, like, vanilla sounds completely. So it's just always it's crazy for me. Not grabbing. Oh, they are going back down for the chicken. Okay. I was wondering what was gonna go on. Okay, bomb chew bowling. Okay. Oof. You gotta watch out. Don't get hit by that. Interesting. Corbin is bailing on River. Did they check the upper um, spot in the river? They just went up to the open grotto. They didn't go any further. Wow. Interesting. Renata doing this freehand, not using the, um... Uh-oh. <clears throat> Uh-oh. I don't think they've got... Maybe... 
Maybe this last one. What was the item? I missed the item. Oh. Another wallet. Okay. Oh, they can't do the... Ch it's another wallet. And they can't do it because they're at a half a heart. So they had to... Freeform it. That's a fair point. Another reason why I'm never gonna play C with one hit KO. I can't yeah, just chat. forget about it constantly and just die yeah. all the time. <clears throat> Kinpachi is going to get strength two here. Okay. Assuming that they don't uh, lose the chicken and yeah. fail. So Kinpachi and Renata them. are both gonna have Valley done. All right, he grabs the chicken. We're gonna get strength two here. Because like I don't need that heart, or they don't want to risk losing the chicken. I think this is our first time seeing the slingshot mini game. Yes, it is. Ooh, F. They almost saved it. Corbin also going for that second um, wallet. Yeah, the medallion knowledge is really useful. Oh, Corbin getting... <laughs> Corbin getting cuckoo blocked by the uh, the big one behind the wall there. Yeah. yeah, I absolutely hate when that's the middle one. Looks like they got it now, yeah. Look, I said Coco blocked for a reason. <laughs> okay, Hylia Foolish. I missed the rest of those. Ah, so, so there's nothing in Boulder of Destiny today. Oh, and Fountain Loft? No kidding. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I think we saw 30, 30 dead. Yeah. yeah. And Pachi going for the back of Lake Hints. See if this Always pays nice out. to see those. Sometimes they're like. It can be huge information. Oh, Goron Tunic, so those wallets aren't for anything. Yeah. Okay. Another Spirit Wath in the back of Lake. Oh, God. Renata. All right, here we go. <laughs> <clears throat> I saw Dodongo's the medallion. That's all I saw. I, I didn't even... <laughs> Okay, so your stones are, your other two stones are Jabu and that way of the hero spirit. Okay. And another 20 skull. So no new information for Kenpachi. That's unfortunate, but that's, that's a risk you had to take. Dark Dylan about to get their first strength. Okay, here's all the, well, Found it. Well is dead. Found his way to the hero. Another 30 in Lake. Yes, we've got a double feature. Two different races going on. With the same got a scene. winners. Yep. We've got a winners match and a losers bracket match as well. Yep, the uh, upper two racers, Kimpachi and Renata, are in the Nocturne winner's bracket, and Dark Dylan and Ven Corbin are in the Requiem lower bracket. Loving the uh, the purple Master Sword there for Ven Corbin. Oh, that, that's nice. They, they do, Sir Nyquil, they have the same seed. I'm expecting Ben Corbin and Renata to eventually be going to Dodongo's pretty soon. 
I would assume so, knowing it's a medallion. Yeah, you want to yeah. knock that out. Picking up some songs, though, that makes absolute sense. That's usually my highest priority, is just picking up the songs so I don't have to backtrack as much. Yep. All right, so we are, we've got a full Forest Temple kit as well. We do, yeah, and Minuet, so. And we might go straight to Forest. Yeah. ZL is in the um, desert. <laughs> All right. At least I got Requiem for that, and it's not one of those walk across the desert. Yeah. Seats. Which I could see it being. You've got magic already. Yeah, and hovers. Yep. Actually, that is fully in logic. Epona, hovers, magic, blend start. It is a bit unfortunate to see, like, checks when we know it's foolish, but... What can you do? When you don't know the information, yeah, you, don't, you know. don't know. Sometimes, sometimes you just, you know, end up doing things that waste time. That's part of uh, Rando. Renata's gonna go across the field. Okay. Probably just making their way to CAC. An interesting way to get to, I usually just go through Lost Woods and then go into Garden City, but I've never like timed anything. Okay. So we can finally see our Whatever is going to be in CAC, whether it's nothing or everything. We're going to see Man on Roof first, or are they going to go straight for Dodongos? They're going straight. Oh, no. No, he's going <clears> to <throat> do the full CAC. Yeah. Ooh, almost over jumped there. Yeah. Whoa, yeah. That was a good save. Nah. Okay. And I believe we've seen this hint as child. Yep, the water bosky. Alright, Renata getting his magic. We're gonna see Hyrule Castle Fairy Fountain from Kimpachi. The crater has Sun Song. Oh, it's always good to route in the Din's Fairy. That can that can really mess with you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it, I, actually, I don't think he's gonna do it. Does he not have ZL yet? I don't think he's gone to. Yeah, no, he hasn't gone to the desert yet. Yep. Um... One of those things when there's four players, I <laughs> you lose track. Yeah. Track of. Oh, good music. I go for this choice. <laughs> Dark Dylan <laughs> letting out his anger. And <laughs> skip the wall. They're like, I don't need to buy Zara Tunic. I'm never gonna buy Blue Fire. Yep. Get me out of here. Reasonable play to make. We're gonna see a reverse <laughs> of uh, the wasteland that I've been in here. <laughs> reverse wasteland this early. Interesting. Well, with the ponas available, you know that it's. Um, I mean, you've got a pretty large kit for GTG. You've got Song of Time right away. You know, bomb, bomb bow, hook shot. No reason not to hammer even the whole thing's a yeah. magic. Yeah, just missing the shrink too. Yeah, we know where, and we know where it is. So that was in the maze, right, Goron City? Yeah. 
just bomb locked in it. Light arrows. Sorry, was that light arrows on um, adult archery? Yep, it was. Oh. You'll never defeat me with the arrows located down the road in the village. <laughs> Yeah, I love it. It's like, you'll never defeat with light arrows, and it's like, in my dose. It's like, oh yeah, I never would have found those without your help. Is this the first time we're seeing Richard? The dog? I believe so, yes. It can be really tricky to route in without Sunsung. Yeah, and we do have magic. Are we going to see a uh, chest game here? That's something I feel like I Ooh. should do, but I always want to skip it because I just don't it like that It takes so check. long, yeah. I'm more likely to do a 1 in 32 <laughs> than I am to, uh, to, to do it. Okay. I'll, I'll never do oh, 1 in 32 now. And Dins is all that's missing. Is that right? We need long shot. Yep, we've got iron boots. Uh, forest we can do. Fire we can do. Dongos we can do. Shadow, we just need Dins. Damn. Yeah, long shot and Dins is all we're short for go mode already. Wow, okay. And we know that Spirit's way of the hero. And and the fountain. So if we see either like Bruto's letter for that, because that's going to be in logic for that. I just wonder if we're going to see anything here in GTG. Oh! Okay. Sure, we'll take a scale. Scale is good. Okay, the seed's opening up now. We see storms in Compose... Composer Grave. So, like, GTG is in Logic, Well is in Logic. There's so much to Ch do, you gotta uh, wonder. Uh, Child Spirit is in Logic. Child Spirit is something I feel like I, I prioritize at this point. Yeah. With the way of the hero. Mm -hmm. And especially with Kenpachi, who I think is the only one who's done both Goron City and the Valley, um, I would definitely, you could definitely see them doing, a, I, you'll probably see Dodongos after Forest Temple. Yeah. And then, um, and then Spirit, then a Spirit play. Have we seen any of them reset to check their adult spawn? I don't think we have, no. We are going to see Dompe, um, the Dompe race here. Okay. Getting a little bit of money. So, time to see if this is a nice seed and just the items are going to be in their medallion dungeons, or if there's just going to be nothing in their medallion dungeons and we're looking for those last couple items for like two more hours. <laughs> Fun. No, yeah. but uh, we know where we've got the unfulfilled ways of the hero, so unless there's some major bait sitting in there. Yeah. I mean, Spirit could just be like Rudo's letter for fountain access. That's a good point. That's a good point. That 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 that, that begs the question: How quickly do we see a uh, King Zora skip? Yeah, I'm not sure how confident all the players are on that. But if they are, that would be a very sensible, sensible thing to do. Yeah. Then Corbin costing themselves a little time, suffering from success by getting <laughs> above 1500 here. This has been a very yeah. low health seed. We're 45 minutes in. Nobody's got more than five hearts. Yeah. And I don't think anyone's been like gipping things that are health. So, everyone who went to the valley skipped the heart container there. Okay, yeah. That's reasonable, though. It's very easy to lose the chicken. And if you're not comfortable with the stick recoil. 
there's nothing worse than doing crate and then not being able to do the waterfall because yeah. you mess up. Oh yeah. <clears throat> All right, it's we're like, seeing a GTG play here. Now, Renata got their Goron has their Goron tunic on. Are we gonna see a? Um, we're gonna see a fire play from them here. Makes sense. You've you've got hovers. There's nothing in logic. You got strength, bomb bag. Yeah. Has, has anyone? Somebody's beaten DC, right? No. No, no one's even gone in yet. That's right. Yeah. Wow. That's the interesting. The GTG is a very risky play, but maybe that's what they're thinking. Is like, I'm just gonna do this, see if it pays off, and gets me the win. That like, could be you do, the, you do the have a pretty part. full kit, but you have a pretty full kit for pretty much everything at this point. Yeah. It's the only thing you know not to do is the well, really. Yeah. Which is a, a blessing, for sure. Oh yeah, Martin's skin. That's a boomerang on the upper river. Oh my god. Oh no. They never. Uh, who was it that went and checked the bottom of the river and never I went think up that, here? I'm pretty sure that was Kenpachi. Okay. Wow. All right. So yeah, we're gonna see a um, an out of lot. I guess it is in logic now. We're gonna go see a ZD play here. Hopefully it's just the fairy fountain and they can get it as child. Well, you need the letter to do that. Yeah, I was thinking something else. I don't know. <laughs> That's okay. Some banjo and kazooie tunes. Oh, yeah, I'm we got... pretty pumped that that's going to be part of the Nintendo Switch Online Oh yeah, that's upgrade. That's just cr it's crazy for the N64 speedrun community in a bunch of different games. I'm not gonna lie, I'm, yeah. I'm excited to see how long it'll take me to play a vanilla ocarina game <laughs> on my big screen TV. Oh, no. So I'd like to point out we've got all four players in completely different areas right now. Uh, yeah, we are guaranteed to not have Quad Forest. Yeah. So that's nice. Because <laughs> so much is open to us at this point. Yeah. There's so many things to do. I'm, I'm actually really happy with the divergence. Solid recoil. I just really don't want to see Van Corbin punished and have something be behind the silver block because they. I think they didn't go valley. Right. I think everyone else has done valley. Right, and Dylan hasn't done Goron City yet. Yeah. We're not either. Yeah. Honestly, there's a good chance there's nothing in here. At least nothing of of much consequence. Yeah. Okay, so we have logic on castle access. Yeah, they can beat forest. Forest fire, Dodongos, and the and the free one. Yeah. No hint for anything there, and no strength three, so it's not the strongest play. But with well dead, and we're gonna have G see what GTD is. Okay, slingshot. I wonder if they're gonna go back to okay. Lost Woods. See if there's an yet another item there, but. Seems that's not the play they're gonna go for. What is he diving for in Foolish Lake here? Oh, sure, Shoot. I would I would dive for that. Oh big oh yeah. Yeah, no that that makes complete sense. Big stabby. Mm -hmm. Large Stabitha has arrived. Mm -hmm. Renata playing really safe with Pulvagia. Pretty easy yeah, to with, die on this fight. With the one heart, I don't blame him. Yeah. 
You ever just get stuck in the one that it pops out of? That like pops out of the one you're bombing and then you're just stuck taking a bunch of damage? Still nothing for uh, Van Corbin from GTG. Are they going to do the? Do we? We've got toilet hinted as a key, right? Uh, yeah, I believe so. Yeah. Okay. I wonder if they saw that. Yeah, I'm not sure who saw. That's one of the hints that I missed that I've only remembered chat seeing saying. Nothing in forest so far. Oh no, we did not get a com. Completed Vobagia. Oh, ooh, that's rough. This is, a, yeah, it's a tough thing to do with low health. Where was the boss key for fire? Was it like right away? Um, must have been pretty early. Um, I didn't quite catch it. If anyone in chat can let us know how far up in fire. This is, this I, is I know it wasn't before. very. Yeah. And this is Dylan's first. Dylan is the last of our runners to. I'm pretty sure it was somewhere before the climb. Check out that sick bow locked bow in GTG. <laughs> and they're and they're out of there. Oh, they're gonna check the maze now, but yeah. Yeah, I know they didn't go up to the second floor of fire, but I don't know where on the first floor of fire it was. Continuing, Kenpachi's continuing forest, found nothing. Fire key was vanilla right under the loop. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. And there's the forest boss key. Um, we're gonna see the maze here for Ven Corbin. There's, I, I'm, I'm struggling to think of what could be here with the Wath layout as it is. That yeah, could help an, them. It's an interesting play, but if they find something here, it's huge if they find yeah. I just, I don't know. Was vanilla, okay. All right, well, we get to see the center chest. We knew that. Mm. Oof. That's a big oof. Ven Corbin not finding anything. Yeah. And uh, they're going to go do yeah. a forest play. So we are going to see double forest here. All right. Have we seen this fairy yet? I don't think we have. On, uh, from Dark Dylan. Uh, not sure. I remember we watched Ven Corbin do reverse. And then they got Z off. I don't know why they wouldn't have. Yeah. They would have had to just walk over it. Yeah, Renata's still having a tough time with Volvagia here. Yeah. This should this be one it. of the fights I've had. Oh no! To oh no! The most. Oh, hoo, hoo, that was close. You still got it. Oh. Oh dear. That does not yeah, feel great. I, I get get it. When you're in a race scenario and you're fighting Volvagia and Heart's tensions pumping. are high. Yeah. Start to we, stay calm. We have no bottles, so no um yeah no fairies. Yeah. <laughs> so we found both of our bows. Oh. They're both bow locked. Is Renata gonna? Oh, they're killing the keys, hoping it drops another heart. Yeah, I mean you can oh. get the you can get a fairy for that if you're just trying to get more health. Yeah. Nothing in forest. Very, very fun and interesting. All right, round three. The Dylan calling Epona. I think they're gonna do the GTG play now. Or they could just be going to CAC and then go clear to Dongos. Uh, or maybe they didn't. <sighs> I mean, there was a lake foolish, and maybe they're going to this grotto? Yeah. 
I don't think we've seen this grotto. I think everyone else has skipped it so far. Yeah. These are ones that are easy to miss, for sure, and then just get punished by. In scenes where I get a bunch of warps early on, I often orphan feel and just yeah. feels bad. Especially considering there's hints in them. Bomb locked choose. I'm really hoping for success for Renata on round three. We're gonna see this. Have we even seen Open Grotto? Because didn't we? Yeah, no, I don't think we have. So I think Renata went straight to Valley. Yep. And then we're gonna see Deku Salesman. So we've only got three Waths hinted so far. Lostwood Spirit and Zora Fountain. So we're missing two items. Concerningly jetty, like one of those, like, it could be like a really quick seed with just like the last two items in their waft locations. Or we. Or there's some ridiculously convoluted logic thing we haven't unearthed yet. Yeah. Or we've just got like long shot on unhinted Baronade. Like, yeah. Or highest Goron. Yeah. yeah. Because I'm betting one of the spirit one is just going to be Rudo's letter. No way the seed is nice enough. And we finally got Vavadji defeated from Renata. They they finally did it. Excellent. So we finally have our second medallion. Coming out. And they have the ability to go clear uh, Forest and Dodongos as well. Yeah, I, th I wonder if they do Dodongos first or if they warp to uh, Forest right away. I would think Dodongos based on the f yeah. songs. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Probably going to check this um, the Crater Fairy as well. Yeah, that makes sense. Do these checks along the way as you make your way towards Dodongos. Makes complete sense to me. Dark Dylan is now adult. Let's see where. Get ready for Triple Forest. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> Kimpachi will get out of there before mm -hmm. Dylan gets in there. <laughs> Although it doesn't huh. look like. Th I mean, they're not warping straight there. Yeah. So. It doesn't say they have Bombay on their tracker, but I'm pretty sure they did. They've been yeah. child for quite a while. Okay, they're going to CAC. And now it's time for Phantom Ganon. Hopefully this boss goes well for them. This one can also be a pain. Still surprisingly low health seed, as you're pointing out. An hour in, and yeah. like. And still five is the most anyone has. Uh, Corbin has six, so. Oh, yep. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be Rudos for a second when I saw a bottle. That's just a generic bottle. Doesn't yep. really help. I though. think it was red potion. Yep, red potion. Fire arrows under oh. CAC. Okay. Okay. 
looking like a pretty clean found Ganon. Oh. Okay. oh they almost had it. Okay. Nothing on ten skulls. We don't have to worry about skulls for no the rest skulls of the all. Yep. Granadas. Yep. Going towards the Dongos. Unfortunate. That's what happens in a low health seed. Yeah. Like it's not just, it's like a very low health seed. Crazy, because like the seed I played last night, everyone had like ten hearts in like forty minutes. It's just like here's all the health. And yeah. nothing else. Yeah, have fun. Go go do everything now. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna see Adult Goron City <clears throat> here from Renata, and we're gonna see the um left side maze too. Hmm. The interesting is now that the players have silver gauntlets. Are they going to go back to child to do spirit for their way of the hero, or are they going to just do some stuff as adult first because they're currently adult? Yeah, I mean, I think you, you finish off your progression. Yeah. <clears throat> before you get into spirit temple. Yeah. So, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I'm just so thinking, finish trying to think ahead goes. once they're at the, that point. At that point, uh, since you have magic and you have a fire source, I think I would just do yeah. adult spirit first, yeah. and unless I and, and find just to find out if I'm key locked, maybe. Yeah. And if you don't find anything, um, on with the checks you can do on, as adult, that's when you yeah. go child. Yeah, especially considering there's no prelude to quickly do it. It's like you're kind of committed to the age you're at. Yeah. Oh wow, with spirit where uh, with uh, storms where it is, it's a good thing we have that. Um, oh yeah. That well foolish. In. Yeah. Well and GTG Foolish are some of the best ones. Yeah, we weren't going to get that GTG uh, Foolish so. hint today because yeah. of that bow-locked bow. Yeah. <laughs> it, it can still be Foolish. Oh, if that's it's true. Locked. I found, like, bomb eggs in Foolish areas because they're bomb-locked. Yeah, that's why you always want to bomb the DMT wall, even if you find DMT foolish. Yeah. Like if you have bomb shoes. Yeah. All right. Got a damp race going on. Yep. And can can Pachi, did Kimpachi die to? Uh, yeah, they did. They did. Well, that's that uh, certainly is good news for Renata, who uh, died a couple of times to Belvagi. Yeah. Uh, it's yeah. time they can make up if they get a clean Phantom Ganon here. <laughs> they just now seem to realize, remember that they've got uh, the Warp Song. <laughs> yeah, that can happen. You miss Mark, or you, you just you get a route in your head, and then you get an item, and then you just forget. <laughs> What you got a 51 for Dylan on the Dompe race, not bad at all. Oh, that is very clean. I don't think I've ever gotten a 51. Yeah, I was just about to say, like, I think the best I've done is 50, so 53 is my best, maybe yeah. 52. But I also placed out of Scrubs tournament, so who's to say? <laughs> And Bolero in the windmill. He's gonna play it right away. Oh, I think we're gonna see a fire play. You can't. From, uh, you can't warp out of the windmill though. That's true. So they're gonna just get that like message of shame. Oh, they don't even see the message because it was canceled with talking. At least they know what they did. <laughs> you know what you've done. 
<laughs> oh not, like... boy, and that's a second uh, a second loss to Phantom Ganon for Kimpachi. It's letting Renata back into this match. Yeah. Like you always gotta stay calm and focused. Like even when you think you're doing bad, don't let it spiral out of control. You can get back in it. Yep, it's uh, nothing's over until you see the dot done from your opponent. Hey, thanks for the raid, Drunas. Big raid. And actually, we just uh, got past the hour mark, so let's do let's do some shoutouts here. Shoutouts, of course, to our four runners here, Renata and Kimpachi in our um, <clears throat> our Nocturne winners bracket round two matchup, and Dark Dylan and Vin Corbin in our. Uh, lower bracket requiem, uh, lower bracket round one matchup, <clears throat> and a shout out to our trackers Melqui and Goonbill and Lee Harold and Goldfish. And a shout out as well to my co-commentator here, Purple Rupees. Thank you for uh, hanging out with me this morning. Yeah, absolutely. All right. It's and my name is Rose Copter. Sure. <laughs> Not sure if we have seen it yet, but the DMC Fairy Fountain is just some arrows, so... There you go. And a uh, shout out to Jimbo for, um, for the restream. Yep. Everyone's working hard to make this tournament an enjoyable experience for everyone. Also... Commentators. I just want to quickly oh, shout out our race mods as well. Uh, Goldfish pulling double duty. Uh, being a race moderator as well as a tracker, so we appreciate that. And Bitsy also race modding behind the scenes, so we appreciate it. Thank you. This is uh, a lot of volunteer work goes into getting these streams off the ground, and this community uh, does a lot of work. I'm very proud to be a part of it. We'll have a little bit of issues with Phantom Ganon. Keeps wanting to volley back. And, and there we go. Kenpache knocks out Phantom Ganon. We're finally done with the Forest Temple. And uh, we never have to see it again. Except for the other two <laughs> yeah. times. There's a Kakwath. Okay. Interesting. Is that for the Fire Arrows? all out because the song was bolero right yeah i don't think we've gotten oh we got magic we got magic in, yeah. in cac so second magic yeah. in forest in shadow temple probably so spirit key logic maybe possibly <laughs> a bomb lock okay. bomb bag oh Kenpachi does have silver so they're gonna go be the first to do adult spirit yes they are so we're gonna see if we're oh maybe not oh uh, yeah I Okay, maybe just getting the song. And there's another fountain. What was that? That must be where the. F that everyone's seen that already. Yeah. Never mind me. Uh, is that a big rupee up top? Get out of there before the levers kill you. Okay. Frogs two dead. I think that's new. Thank goodness. Oh no! See, they are going to spirit. They're going yep. back in. Let's see if we're locked here. Hope it's not a like vanilla mirror shield. Gross. For stone spirit, you <laughs> good god. Long shot on Rova. <laughs> yeah. Finally somebody goes into Dodongo's cabin. Yeah. Spheres your oh and we're gonna get um <laughs> we're gonna get bomb chew strats here from Dylan. 
Yeah. I've not seen the sword set up with that, with crouch stabs. Wow, well done. Very clean. Yeah. Yeah, very clean. Nice. That's something I always have to, like, go back and reference. Because I don't do it all the time, so I yeah, forget. I definitely don't have that down. Now, is he going to complete... Okay, it looks like he is going to still complete DC. I don't yeah. see why he wouldn't, but... Yeah. There's another copy of the toilet small key hint. Yep. And we saw center GTG, so it doesn't really matter. There's no situation where they need to get that key. Especially starting with Song of Time. Right. Let's see if Ben Corbin can get a clean Van Ganon. Or if they're gonna have to struggle as well. Who knows? Maybe Fan Gan's gonna be mean. Yeah, the one to watch for the Phantom Ganon fight is Renata to see if they can uh, make up the ground yeah. um, from the Volvagia fight. Yep, since those two are on the same race, so... But yeah, it looks like we've just got... We're, players are just doing their medallion dungeons and their way of the heroes right yep. now. Very, uh, yep, very obvious plays by everybody. Yep. That's, uh, no, I don't mean that in a bad way. Um, yeah, no. Yeah. No. Lots of players decided to do a lot of child since Prelude is on the Ocarina, so they just wanted to, like, let's just get child done. Yep. So I don't have to worry about it. Zora Tunic in a WAF location makes me upset. Yeah. <sighs> to see, I, I knew it was just going to be something. I knew the seat couldn't be that nice. Ben Corbin's not. I wonder where Ben Corbin's gonna go. I imagine DC. Yeah, just maybe go fire. Lost. Yeah, they're putting on their Zora tune. I mean, a uh, Goron tunic. I think we're gonna see a fire play here. Yeah. Go get your medallions done. That makes sense. Ooh, sorry for the yelling. Okay. It's gonna be really unfortunate if all they get is a Zora If all you see is a Zora tunic, do you go back and do Child's Spirit? Hope there's something on those chests. I think you do. We've seen uh, uh, the adult spawn is in the market, right? Have we seen the adult spawn? Uh, I don't recall if we have. A big Poe bottle. And, and Zora. Oh my god. Rudo's letter is in DC. We okay. get a scale. Okay. A scale and a big Poe bottle in um, Way of the Hero Spirit. Yeah. That's our first. Bob. You have iron. Okay. No, okay. no. Rudo's is. Yeah, never mind. Yeah, it can't, it can't be scale because Lake is dead. That's the only thing. Exclusively scale locked. Right. And we have irons, so it's not yeah. tech tight. Mm hmm. And Ooh. it can't be the big Poe bottle because we've got access to Rudo's letter and we can get that opened. Yeah. So hopefully that's just something we actually need, like long shot. Still, so Zora Tunic is still the only thing that uh, might actually be it. Mm -hmm. Wait, Zark, haven't we seen? We've seen both wallets. That's true. You're absolutely right. I just so remember that. that. Yep. So we're still looking. Yep. Well then, let's hope it's not mirror locked. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Dark Dylan with the the he's calling glass bank shots. I wonder if the oh. players are going to go child with that letter. 
I, you've got, I, you've got, would, you've got, let, sorry. I was just gonna say, I would do uh, Zora skip, knowing that yeah. letter's available now, yeah. um, and just hope that Jabu's not, yeah, yeah, not a thing. Because you have ZF, you have the boots. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's one of the things with Rang, it's, it is a risk you could play. But a, a very big risk. Oh boy, that's that's a little scary. Kimpachi setting up the uh getting the column knocked over so he can get some hearts back, but that's still not enough to avoid a one hit KO. Yeah. Ah, gotta watch that backswing. Oof. Yo, oh, there it is. Raw. It's supposed Insert. to be a scrub seed. Why don't they? Why do they have like no health? <laughs> yeah, right. Vin Corbin finally doing adult cack, getting the uh, the magic there. Oh, I dig this music. Dark Dylan starting their forest. Yep, we can safely ignore Dark Dylan. <laughs> With all respect. <laughs> of course. Okay. Corbin's about to get their light arrows. Yeah, Kenpachi didn't find anything. And uh, is taken off, they might... Well, what else uh, would there be for them to do? I guess they could do the boss key and that's about it. Yeah. Not sure. That's right, they died to the iron knuckle. Yeah. Do they have enough keys to go up to do boss key chest? I'm just wondering if I that was even an option for them. Yeah. Because yeah. that's completely understandable to skip it, but it's just something to keep in mind. Especially when you have uncleared Way of the Hero. <laughs> yep. And they need to get into Dodongo's so they know that the Rudo, that Rudo's letter is available. Oh, I see. So Kenpachi does not have the other wallet, so they might be th following that Zora Tunic oh, way. Oh, you know. I see. I think that's what we're seeing here. Which in okay, context yeah, we're gonna get a sense. water dip. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Yeah. One wallet was on bomb two bowling. I'm not sure. Don't remember where the other one was. I think it was really early. Yeah, and we but don't I have a water foolish in today, so yeah. It was um, it was bomb two bowling, and uh, 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 mountain talons chickens. So yeah, they were yeah. both early uh, available real early. Okay. Okay. Oh, so Kampachi must know, because I think I remember them now do Bachu bowling and then just skipping the wallet. Maybe they just remembered that. Because they're, I think they're headed to the desert. Yeah. Why, okay, so why wouldn't you do Fire Temple at this point? Not sure, maybe they just completely focused on items and saving them without I'm not sure what Yeah, I don't see do I don't see why you do GTG before you do fire here. Yeah. Unless there's some logic we missed. Oh no, they're looking at the tech tight grotto. Okay. Yeah, this is just a field play. Okay. So I know we've seen the Storm's Grotto in Trail, but have we seen the Kokiri Forest one? Have they I gone back to that? do not think so. 
So that's a random check. Yep. Frogs one, two, for that matter. Yeah. Nothing in the grotto. Unfortunate. Find tech tech grotto to be one of the most difficult checks to route in, unless I'm like going to GGG the intended way. Yeah, for sure. Other than that, I can't think of any great time to do it. <laughs> Got a raid from Jax. How are you doing, Jax? Jax Astronomy, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, everybody. We have... Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, we got a potentially pretty quick seed. We've got Way the Heroes that yeah, we're missing cover everything, but... Right, we're missing two items, and we've yeah. got two unresolved Waths. Yeah. We saw Adult Spirit from Kenpachi, but all we found was a Zora Tunic, and we have both wallets, so... It's either Child Side, Mirror Locked, or Bosky Chess. I don't think there's any potential baits left either. Yeah, yeah, we've, we've got, we know, we've got the boomerang, mirror shield maybe, uh, but I don't know what that would be bait for because yeah. there's no oh, ocarina's nothing. Yeah, and if it is mirror shield, it's just pointing to another an item spirit that actually we, is required. Oh, what? Okay, so big pose is the claim check. Sure. <laughs> what a fun little trail this is. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, if, for those of you in the raid, um, we have a, uh, these are two separate races and they've all, they're all playing the same seed, but the top, uh, the top two, Kenpachi and Renata, <clears throat> are in the Nocturne uh, winner's bracket in the second round in the Nocturne division. And the bottom two, Dark Dylan and Ben Corbin, are in the uh, lower bracket of Requiem. But yeah, all play in the same seed. And it looks like Dark Dylan's setting up the uh, bomb, uh, bomb jump strats in Forest. This is a, uh, a really neat strat. Yeah, I always forget to do this. I never end up doing it. It, it feels rare to have everything you need by the time you're doing Forest, though. Yeah. I don't remember what this item was. Kampachi. Oh, yeah, fire arrows, okay. I remember it was an item, but I didn't recall what it was. I think Corbin getting their sun song. All right, so here's Renata, um, Renata going into Phantom Ganon. Now, Renata uh, lost to Volvagia a couple of times, but Kenpachi came into Forest first and lost to Phantom Ganon a couple of times. If, Kenpa if, if Renata has a clean Phantom Ganon here, uh, they can make up a little bit of time on that. That's not it. There it is. Pachi finally gets their magic. I'd also like to point out for anyone who's joined us recently how low health this seed has been. Oh. It's just been punishing quite a bit of players. Corbin seems to be picking up more health as we go. Hmm. Yeah, Corbin has had a very like thorough approach to this seed. And so this is other... a tough one to do. Okay, there it is. Oh yeah, I am not a fan of that peak. I struggle with the position on it. Renata, very Gotta low health. Very careful here. Oh, not quick enough on the on the crouch stabs. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. I'm just curious when we're gonna see the 
Ice for fountain play. Oh, Renata. There you go. That was a clincher. Yeah. Whew. And oh, and Dark Dylan losing to the uh, the Stalfos in for, uh, forest. Hey, <laughs> okay, feel free to ask any questions. Us on comms and Chad will be happy to help you with anything you're not understanding. Oh yeah, we're basically speaking a different language. Yeah. And I'm losing my voice, which is yeah. great an hour and a half into a three hour scene. What is bait? Bait is basically an item that is logically required by the seed, so the game is like assuming without any skips or anything that you need to do it but you can often do it without that item the game doesn't know that we can cheat yeah such as getting to goma requires a slingshot to go through the intended path however b1 skip is an option last race i calmed somebody uh gave up on b1 skip and we got to see dlc <laughs> Deku. oh no Tunics are another one. Yeah, in previous versions of this tournament, the lens was a really notorious bait item. Oh, yeah. And settings that are not scrubs where you... Yeah. I just have a quick announcement unrelated to the race. Um, for any racers in chat, it appears that we are now allowing the Dolphin emulator to be used for official races. Um, which Dolphin is a VC emulator as opposed to an N64 emulator. Um, so if you have, or if you have, if you feel the need to use the Dolphin emulator and you want to check out the requirements to be able to use it, you can head over to the Ocarina of Time Randomizer Discord and check out the racing announcements channel and all the information will be posted in there. Ooh. Interesting. I can finally have shiny graphics. I can't wait to emulate an emulator. It's emulators all the way down. All right. Second try is a charm for Dark Dylan. Absolutely. Always hints are stat like with these settings, you're always gonna find a 30 stall hint somewhere on one of the gossip stones. Yep, or Ocarina of Time, or yep. the Skull Mask. Yep, and then sometimes it's just a pool of just random like one-off checks that are different every seed. There's a pool of like probably like what 25, 30, would you say? Uh, I'm not sure how big the pool is. Um, I'm, I'm looking at Kenpachi here. He's He's got a bottle going into here, so he's going to pick up uh, a fairy and probably have an easier time with uh, Volvagia because of it. They forgot to equip their bottle. What are, what are you doing? Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Dark Dylan finding that bow locked bow. Yeah, right now we're just seeing different dungeons we need to play. And we've seen them all from other players. We've seen all of Dodongos. We've seen fire up through where Bosky is. And we've seen yeah, that's a good question if um, Kenpachi maybe goes deeper in fire. Yeah. I don't see why you would at this point. You yeah. still got Dodongos to do, but yeah. With how early boss key it. That's sometimes a play I'll make if I'm like halfway through fire and I'm not key locked and I don't have any other logic to like situationally I will. Yeah. If I'm Renata, I definitely go do King Zora skip after finishing DC. Yeah. Is Renata gonna be the first to get all their the four medallions? Yes.
I'd say Renata's pretty far in front of Kenpachi at this point in their race. The uh, lower bracket race seems a little closer at this point. I would kill for... Yeah, I've heard the DS remake of Diddy Kong Racing was not as well received, but I've never played it or seen it, so I don't know why. So now if you're Ben Corbin, you know that the the Wathen spirit is not, you know, Rudo's letter, which we assumed earlier. You gotta wonder when you go to do that. <laughs> the only person who's dipped spirit okay. at this point is... Who dipped spirit? Oh, if we get Diddy Kong Racing on Switch Online, that would be fantastic catch-up. I mean, I, I can see it. They, they got Banjo-Kazooie from Rare. Yeah. yeah, I don't see any copyright reasons if they can get the second party Rare games. Donkey, Donkey Kong goes out. Day. Yeah. We had Donkey Kong on Nintendo still because Donkey Kong was a Nintendo property, so right. they still had all the rights to it. It was a bit different for like Banjo and other. Yeah, Jax, we had a full kit for um, Forest and Fire pretty early, and all runners did a reasonably thorough child section as well. Yep. We also know that Well is dead, so there's not really much to go back to for Child except for some one-off checks. Yeah, and, and we do have Boomerang, so Jabu is full clearable if yeah. it comes down to that, but... <laughs> Alright, let's see if Kenpachi can make up the time they lost on Magic yeah, Ganon. That's something we've been questioning. It was very accessible early, but we saw some interesting plays like we saw gtg first yeah vin corbin did a gtg play that i think we questioned yeah they did a reverse wasteland to gtg we're not Which quite we, sure what the yeah. thought process was behind that but i mean i can see it like i said we had a full kit for that too and we had song of time so uh, as our starter song so you had a feeling <clears throat> that something might be there but um it's a gamble when you have progression available instead. The thing that I'd also like to point out is that one of the strengths was in Valley. Yes. So I, I don't think, think Ben Corbin's been there. Ben Corbin hasn't done Valley, and Dark Dylan has not done Goron, Goron City. City. And I can I see Dark Dylan doing Goron City Maze before Corbin goes Valley. Oh yeah, a way of the hero could be strength three. Yeah. Nocturne, I don't think we've seen. Might be in... Oh jeez, that might be on Burning Cac. Might be an ice cavern. Yeah. And if you're going to Fountain, you might do ice while you're there. Yeah, I think so, depending on what you find. Yeah. I mean... No, I wish we had Ferraris. Yeah, I was gonna say, with Ferraris, it's not a question. Then you just place Ferraris in ice. But with the chance of Nocturne in ice... ...and no Ferraris, I think I would just do it. It looks like Kenpachi had a pretty good Volbagia there. Mm -hmm. So... They made up for their Phantom Ganon uh, issues earlier. Yeah. And now Renata is the first player to four medallions. Mm. Yeah, Picking up the piece of heart because <laughs> we are still very low. Yeah. Yeah. Completely understandable. Yeah, very long childs. I think the first person went adult at like 40 something minutes 
All right, Renata. Um, I'd say the the play is uh, is go to ZF and do a King Zora skip. He's checking. They uh, the, uh, yeah, he's checking ten skulls. Let's see what's there. Yeah. So we've but got. We know that's a nut, I think. Both yeah. thirty and twenty skull hints. The seed. So skulls are completely irrelevant. The seed, which makes me happy. Yeah. Screw skulls. Yeah. yeah. That's my playstyle to just risk and just be like, yeah, I'm not going to do skulls. Yep. Then Corbin is going to find the fire boss key and they'll probably go right to Volvagi as well. So for the Dark Dylan and Corbin race, Dylan uh, has Dodongos on their side completely. Yeah, yeah, it feels like they're ahead because of that. Yeah. Probably, probably because of the got... GTG dip. Yeah. Hey. For all we know, there's something behind the strength block in GTG. That's something to point out that we didn't see behind the strength block. This is some pretty intense flare dancer music. This is battle music from Majora's Mask, I think. Okay, yeah, I don't, I'm not too familiar with Majora's Mask, actually. It's something I'm ashamed to admit, but. We're going to see what's on bigger on. Oof. That sword is my finest work. And it's just a piece of heart of which I can find dozens of it. There's so many. Apparently not, though. <laughs> Dark <laughs> Dylan taking a second after seeing the vanilla boss key. <laughs> All right, and Renata is indeed doing the uh, uh, King Zora play. Let's see, it's gonna be long shot, dins. Strength three for both in the castle. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, after that, I think you pretty much just let the item guide you for whatever's in fountain. It is a good question of what of if you do Ice Cavern yeah. for the song, because if it's Nocturne, you need to do it. Mm -hmm. That's why I think I would. No fast way back. Right, unless one of the other items in Fountain is Ferraris. <laughs> All right, let's see if uh, if Renata's got a, ki a clean King Zora skip in him. So far, so oh, I think he lost it there. Oh, mm, yeah, I lost it. Recently, I've been having a lot of troubles with this one. I understand. This I yeah, cool. I wonder what kind of controller Renata uses. I had a lot of trouble with it when I was using a GameCube tr controller. When I switched back to N64, it became a lot easier. Okay, maybe that's my problem. <laughs> so I'm on a GameCube controller on VC. Yeah, there are definitely other ways to do the skip. As well. Yeah. Ooh, Kenpachi missing the, the bomb flower as the Goron goes by. Kind of the beauty of OT though, isn't it? That there's like, for every skip, there's like five different ways to do it. Yeah, absolutely. It's a well-coded game, obviously. <laughs> Oh, I think he's got it now. That's looking pretty good. Here we go. Hey! Nice. All right. I'm feeling a long shot, personally. Long. Okay. Long shot just on the iceberg. Are we even going to see it? I hope so. He's <laughs> going straight to the ferry.
I think that's double cack waff. I haven't been keeping track of the waff hints. We saw one cack waff in the wall in DMC. Where was the other one? Maybe that was the only one we've seen. Long shot in the fairy fountain. Okay. Yeah. That all that opens up is water, which is four item checks. Yeah. So I I think you do ice. Cause after water, what are you gonna do? The castle. Yeah. Or spirit, child spirit. That's just choose, I think. Yeah. Yeah. We haven't seen the iceberg yet. He's gonna pick up the choose, though. Okay. These are convenient to have, for sure. Mm -hmm. Then Corbin, gonna go into DC here. Following in Kimpachi's footsteps. Players just don't like the dongos, I think, with how long they put it off. Oh, wow. Yeah, where are you going? Just to get this... They're not doing DC? All right, piece of heart on the iceberg. Yeah. Okay. Not even randomized. Okay. I don't think they've seen it yet. There we go. No, all players have strength too, except Ben Corbin still missing theirs in Valley, which is understandable, but also very unfortunate if. Like, yeah, if the there's not a, another one out there somewhere. Yeah. Because if I weighed the hero and spirit is actually just mirror shield locked. And then Ben Corbin's just running around trying to look for strength too, to go get to it. Or maybe they'll be rewarded and find another strength. Dense and Child Spirit. Uh, oh, has somebody mirror, done? Mirror locked or B boss key. What was your question? Um, have we seen the Sung Song grave yet? I don't think anyone backtracked to this. No. Well, there you go, big rupee. Yes, found his way of the hero. Yep, that uh, was in uh, Desert Colossus. Long shot. Yeah. In the uh, fairy. Oh. oh, you mean the item, not the hint. Sorry. Was that a save quit by Ven Corbin? Or both of our what? save warps in, uh, in Kokiri's Forest? Yep, that was a save warp. I did catch that. And uh, Dylan is going to show us our first uh, castle, I think. It's that or Go Child, yep. Which I can understand Go Child too, because we don't have our spirit wath yet. Yeah. But doing this before doing either of our unresolved waths is, I don't know. Something I would do if I were panicking in a race, probably. Yeah. The 1v1 meta is crazy. Could be a game of, I know my opponent's gonna clear the overworld, and I'm gonna get punished if I don't. Yeah. Just like clear these random checks. That's why you do GTG before all your progression. <laughs> To me, that just read as a, I'm going to take a silly risk and hope it pays out. And it's not even that, that silly. It's not like they had yeah. to do hook shotless or anything. Yeah. It's mostly the, a priority oddity, not so much the choice to actually do it. Yeah. Slingshot percent.
So we've got fire, so we're gonna be able to see everything besides light trial, I believe. Yeah. Unless strength is in here. Yeah. That would be insane. Those, those fire arrows were in a WAF location. Although, with long shot available. Oh, yeah. They're, yeah, they're, that, they wouldn't be WAF for this, because long shot is available. Unless this is dense. Oh, good point. Right. Well, or am I, no, or am I, you, yeah, because you don't need fire. Oh my god, French Vanilla Strength 3. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I just flipped fire arrows and Den's logic around in my head. Oh, interesting, they're gonna... See if there's anything on this one. Nada. That is a great place to find Strength 3, though. Yeah. It does make sense to do that. Oh, no, no, King Zora's dead. Never mind. Yeet that rock! But now do you walk outside and do the one outside? I think so. Just feels so bad to do that. It feels so out of the way. Easier when you're still doing skulls, right? Yeah. So that's strength two for Ven Corbin, which is actually kind of a bailout if there's nothing here in Light yeah. Trial. Yeah, that's always the interesting thing about randomizer is sometimes missing items saves you time because it lets you skip something that wasn't necessary. Yeah. Depends on the seed. Alright, so now we're gonna see what the song is in Ice Cavern. And it is oh, it's Saria's. So that means, um, Nocturnes on Burning Cac? Which means ice was a waste of time. Dang. Unless, of course, there's something on Darunia. Yeah, Darunia or, or, Skull or Skull Kid, Kid. Way of the Hero, um... Yeah, yeah with Way of the Hero... Lost Woods. We already got a couple items in Lost Woods, so I doubt it, but still. So the only thing was titties in <laughs> that trial. Boy. Alright, so Kenpachi is now going to go up the river. Okay. Going to get the boomerang that they missed earlier because they went up river and then only did uh, check this lower that is true, yeah. Peeps in the open grotto, and then... That's gonna failed. spook him. Just notice both of our players in the Kampachi Renata race now that they have Boomerang until right now. Yeah, the only person who's actually come up the, that far up the river is Dylan. Yeah. look like there's much else in Ganons besides the strength to tell you hey do more Ganons for no reason oh Ven Corbin uh, might get bailed by that and unless there's something on the um, the outside Ganons castle yeah light trial isn't that slow but it still is time save also, I think Dylan's the only person who's dove in the lake to get bigger on sword. Oh yeah, that's true. Uh, 
that could potentially make a bongo easier. Yeah, bongo and and the Ganon fights. Yeah, and Ganon, of course. Double Stalfos fight in our bottom bracket match. Yeah, double Stalfos, and we're not even in Fire Temple. I mean, Forest Temple. <laughs> yeah, they're right on top of each other. Yeah, same adapt. So Dylan resets. Then Corbin's gonna walk out. Okay. And Renata is going to show us Water Temple here. All right, finally. <clears throat> doing progression before doing um, the castle, which turns out to be a great play in this scenario. Here's where the boss. Think. Yeah, I, it could be Central Pillar with uh, Zora's tunic as yeah. a Wath uh, in a Wath location. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but then we remembered the wallets. Oh, that's right. Well, it could still be there. Yeah, but I'm still curious yeah, where it's going to be. Not for that. So we're seeing a different version of the uh, King Zora setup from uh, Rena uh, from a uh, Kimbachi. Yeah, I think this is the one I switched to doing since I was having trouble with it. Oh my, a mirror shield. Where was that? Uh, we're about to see what. I think that's OGC. Was. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. And now you gotta go back to Spirit. I don't. Have they done Spirit at all yet? Uh, I think Impachi is the only one who's done spirit at all of many of these four yes that is bad news for Ven Corbin I mean they, they'll get to the they're missing the valley right yeah Oof. that's they are going child now so if it was a child spirit play they'd be warping already How much of water are we going to have to do? Oh, usually most of it. <laughs> I mean, last night I had to do... It was boss key in the river, blocked by ice cavern, and Disgusting. foolish water. And, and water was foolish. It was like, thank you? Yeah, thanks, game. I wonder what play this is from Child Goron City, maybe? And Lost Woods cleanup? Yeah, d um Did they get Sarias? No, no, Sarias was nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Still checks you can do. D Dins on Rova. Yeah. Disgusting. I mean they intentionally just right now equipped slingshot. I don't think we've seen the Storm's Grotto that I was mentioning. That's true. We're going to see that yep. now. We're also yep. going to see Frogs 1 now. We're going to see both Storm's <laughs> checks here. Ben Corbin doesn't believe in backwalking. That's fine. Oh, come off it. <laughs> the third bomb bag. So you either get no bomb bags or all of them. Oh, and we're going to see this. Uh oh. It was the Goron. Oh, where was that? Okay. I missed There was no. Yeah, that we haven't seen a GC Wath. What? 
I missed that entirely. Oh, Gaganans. I was thought that was Goron City. Alright, so it is in fact a child Goron City play here. <laughs> Nothing on the frogs. I'm really curious about that spirit now. That mirror shield is a pretty cruel location if you haven't done valley. Yeah, for sure. Uh, then Corbin's gonna see the boomerang here and probably get baited into a uh, Jabu play. Yeah, that's possible. That's a beautiful boomerang. Oh. Are we gonna see the chew strat for the pot? I love this strat. Yeah. I'm so glad I learned that one. That's one that saves me so much headache. I'm pretty good at getting the bomb in there, so I never bothered. Uh, for me, it's more of a case of early game wanting to do that check and not having bomb bag. Mm, true. So I definitely would prefer doing that over using a bomb flower. Yeah, I don't think any of us know, Bitsy. <laughs> Yeah, unfortunately, I don't. I'm sorry. And I think I think we are going to get a Jabu play, although it, it might be just to move this over because they're not confident in their King Zora skip. That's always a possibility. Yeah, long shot is something they can get as child. It's on the ferry. Yeah, but oh, uh, oh, they're there's thinking about it. We just saw the skull kid hint. So they're coming in here to do the check, but they didn't grab any grab a fish, so I don't think they're doing Jabu. Okay, so this is actually going to pay off. The songs are hard. I think they have a couple other empty bottles as well. Alpha. I never saw the 20 skulls hint, I guess. Mark Dillon turns in the letter. Alright, Dylan is not going to uh, oh. go and Child get his long shot. This is a child spirit play. Yep. Okay. Corbin gets there, long shot. This is some spooky, uh, I don't know. This is cutting it close. Six. Oh, oh, wow, Renata. Planned. Calculated. Nothing. That can also be off for Vanilla Nocturne. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, no, that's. I'm pretty sure that's what it's going to be. Actually, I think we know that's what it is. Oh, yeah, or it could be the Prelude check. That's right. Either way, water is locking it. All right, let's see if, uh, I mean, I guess, I guess if that Ganon's castle hint exists, then yeah, we're, we're, we know for a fact that Din is going to be mirror shield blocked.
Does that put a skill mode? Unless I'm forgetting something. If as soon as we find bins, yeah. I think if it's on Twin Rova or in the mirror, uh, mirror locked spot, yeah. Yeah. Like if it's directly and not like. Uh, I don't even think there's any bait left. It could be pointing to. Yeah. No. We're we we know we know we don't have to do yeah. Jabu basically. Yeah. It can't be like there's no other items. I want to see like Dins be like right here in Child Spirit, and the mirror shield is completely irrelevant. That'd be crazy. Long shot for Kenpachi. Oh, rip the shield. Flaming song, gotta love it. Right. Yeah, nothing on child side. So it is mirror locked. Which is good news for Dylan, he just doesn't know it yet. Yeah. Happy two hours, by the way. Mm -hmm. Shout out to our runners in the uh, Nocturne Division winner's bracket oh. match between Kenpachi and Renata, and the Requiem Division lower bracket match between Dark Dylan and Vent Corbin. Follow, give them a follow. Our trackers who are keeping us uh, apprised of the situation here, Melqui and Goombill, Lee Harold and Goldfish. Thank you so much for the for the help there. And a shout out. A shout out to my co-commentator, Purple Rupees. Thank you for hanging out with me this morning and carrying my raggedy voice across the finish line. <laughs> no problem. Glad I have someone here to bounce off of. I'm not doing it alone. And my name is Rogue Copter, and another shout out to Jimbo on the restream. So we've got early boss or early ish boss key. We found it behind the push block here in water. It looks like Kenpachi is immediately coming to water, which makes sense. Medallion, able to full clear it if you have to. Some more great uh, time of day routing. Dylan coming up to the uh, castle just as the thing lowers. Yeah. Unless I missed him play Sun Song and I'm just sounding like an idiot. And I missed where was the boss key in water. Behind the trank block. Uh, okay, yep. So, mid-ish water. Central bow, yeah, that's what it's called. So we don't have to do Darkling today. On the seed where you have like no health, you don't have to do Darkling. Of course, and we're taking we're taking our Morpha for a walk here. One cycle is a one cycle if you get it. Oh, I think they got it. Yeah. That puts Renata at the to be the first to get five medallions. And they should be able to uh they'll probably do a Goron's uh, Ganon's Castle play at this point. Yeah. Or they might go, well no, because you need dins. So yeah, I can see them doing a Ganon's Castle, finding your uh strength three. Yeah, we do Finding have your mirror shield. Oh, Dark Dylan wants another hint. <laughs> See if this is anything useful. No, just a repeat. Uh, so where where are both our magics? There is one we just got. Sorry, 
where was the second magic? I think it was in water. On Morpha, I think. Oh, okay, yeah. Magic was... Right. Yeah. Well, did you need magic to get to this magic? Uh, I don't think so. Fire, yeah, it's gotta be Vanilla Nocturne. Runners are making surprisingly good pace, even though we weren't quite sure what everyone's priorities were. You know, this feels like a sub 3 thing if people follow the breadcrumbs as they're laid out in front of them. I think Renata's gonna go... ...cack now. Or Temple of Time song. Oh, they want to check these grottos while they're here. Looks like Kenpachi is gonna do Dark Link. So we're gonna see this before we before he does Central Bow Pillar. He's gonna lose time for that. Interesting decision. It's six and one half dozen in the other. He just happened to pick the wrong one. Yeah. I mean, it's random. So. Yep. That's random. <laughs> Sad to see if no Ferrars wind at all this seed. It always in opens up interesting routing possibilities, but it does see do that play. You know, that's, that's a good point, Lee. I would still usually do the bow locked. Oh, mirror shield was in OGC. Oh, yeah. And Van Corbin um, does not have another strength in the valley. Okay, Dylan is chasing after their fountain walk. They're gonna get long shot. Probably go water right after. At least we haven't seen the Jabu play yet. Yeah. Yeah, I really hope Corbin does the valley before they resort to a Jabu play. Yeah. Sucks when you get down to that few checks and you're just like valley. It's like, which one hasn't my opponent done? Because <laughs> it's like, you get one v ones get to your head, like that. <laughs> that 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 claim check on big pose is so mean. What, did you think you were done running around? Yeah, I just opened a tracker and clicked. Dins is literally the only thing they don't have, so... That has to be the spirit. Well, if there's like... No explanation. Like, right? Unless I'm missing something. It is a gorgeous mirror shield.
Yeah, I kind of want to like just like mess with cosmetics sometimes and just try to find something nice. I usually just completely randomize them, but seeing some cool stuff players come up with. Yeah, what was the uh, song just there? Uh, well, whatever it is, it's not vanilla. It's serenade. Serenade. Late two hours in, get serenade, still no prelude. That's... That's not fun. Kind of means the super long child at the start makes sense. And pay off. When it's a huge commitment to change ages. Yeah. I find that late prelude seeds you have to play completely differently. Yeah, the routing decisions are definitely a lot more complicated. Otherwise, it's just like, oh, I got my item for Shadow. I'm just going to go do it right now. So is, so Dylan's going into ice. Probably still thinking he might need to for Nocturne. I, I would say, Tuba Man, I would, I would say he's probably got it in his head that if Nocturne's here, he doesn't want to leave the location. Yeah, that and he'll get sorry as and it'll bum him out. Yeah, they haven't ruled that out that uh Well with two magics they might be able to deduce that cack is walk for the uh burning cack song. But fire arrows are there yeah, too. Yeah, even then fire arrows is in your head. Yeah. Especially with a spirit walk. Yeah. Did we see a key on one of the magic lock checks in Child Spirit? I adult could only did? not possibly remember. Yeah, I, I might as well ask. Because if there was, then you're just like, oh, fire arrows are walk. And then Nocturne is very likely here. Yep. Within context of where Dark Dylan is, ice makes sense. Alright, and here comes strength three for Renata. They're gonna finish Shadow Trial though. Hmm. Oh. The bubble got in the way. <laughs> They're gonna end up doing that, uh barren light trial too before they get out to OGC. There's nothing you can The only reason Corbin was able to skip it is because they didn't have the valley strength, so You're right. I don't think anyone would be crazy enough to just not do light trial. That would be Yeah without an without, without an OGC Woth. <laughs> Yeah, the double defense is pretty big lifesaver in a, like, five-heart seed. Where is all the health, anyways? They've been leaving a, a, a bit of it behind. Okay. Yeah, I think because there was a heart container on bottom two bowling, I remember. It oh, could well. be in the well, too, yeah. Just like, well, three heart containers in the well. So unfortunately, Dark Dylan's not going to find anything in this ice cavern. It's just here to make you sad. Yep. But you gotta... I, I yeah. definitely see doing it. Yeah. And Pachi's going to get his... Get their... Uh... <laughs> Sorry, I'm tired. Boss key, <laughs> yeah. Boss key here in this chest. Season, like season one of Scrubs, 
I don't remember that race. Yeah, I, I, I didn't show up until season two of Scrubs. Yeah. I just also confuse it with the other tournaments that also go by seasons. So I'm just like, like season one. Because Scrubs is one. This is season three. Scrubs. And we just finished season four of the standard tournament. Yeah. And since I've been playing for a couple of years. Oh, Shuckles. we got a big. Five on one. With a big old raid of 55 people, welcome in to uh, this this four-way. Well, it's it's two separate one-on-one -on -one races. Everyone's playing the same seed. Kenpachi. Yep. Kenpachi and Renata are in the uh, winner's bracket round two in the Nocturne division. And Dark Dylan and Ben Corbin are in the lower bracket of round one of the Requiem division. <clears throat> We've had a pretty interesting seed. It's been pretty easy item locations. Uh, it was kind of interesting. We had no Serenade or Prelude early, so both, pretty much every runner did a very long child. That was like 40. I think first player went all at like 45 minutes or something. And uh, the one unfortunate thing is uh, Ben Corbin did not go to Valley, so they did not get a strength. Yeah, there. that's going to end up uh costing them i think in the long run unless dark dylan uh now see with with uh uh yeah they've got the long shot they have it all put out in front of them they've got a as long as they they know they know what they're doing and follow the um the route that's laid out before them they should have a pretty clear path to to the victory at this point um Unless Ben Corbin turned around and went to Valley immediately upon leaving water, and even then, it it you gotta still do the full Ganon's Castle to figure out that what you want is an OGC. Yeah, pretty brutal if you think about it. Valley for strength three to go outside Ganon's. You're right. Mirror shield, and and your strength three ends up being in Ganon's. Why is Zelda the most fashionable person in Hyrule? Because she is really chic. <laughs> That's a good one. I'll take it. Um, and Renata found uh, his mirror shield and is going straight to the desert. I guess gonna check the fairy. Yeah, yeah I'd, I'd say as well. Interesting play to check this first, but fair enough. They don't yeah. have boomerang, so for all they know, that this. Yeah. yeah. Oh my! <laughs> that was terrible. Yeah, I don't <laughs> even know what Zell is. It's like a PayPal competitor. Oh. Thing, I think. I'm not familiar with it, but I've heard the name. <clears throat> Alright, um, so do we want to, uh, there's like two, po there's like three possible spots that Dins could be, right? It's like yeah. the, the, the two mirror spots and then Twin Rova. Yeah. So not not much of a bet to do here at this point. <laughs> Bottom of the Wells Fargo is very good. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, okay, he saved it. So unless we're... Oh, they're gonna get this, just in case. Oh yeah, they, Renata has not done Adult Spirit at all, so they have no idea where it is. Yeah. Unless we've missed something, Renata should be entering Go Mode when they find 
dens and a mirror lock check. I think Kenpachi's not too terribly far behind. Boo. Triforce. <laughs> I like the like jokes that aren't it's just like and that and it's just like what did he say pull weird mm. okay you've already got I guess he just feels more comfortable with that up there maybe they thought they didn't had the water at a different level Maybe. All right, Ven Corbin getting Nocturne, which does nothing for them until they figure out the valley has their strength three. So I think Kenpachi's route is going to be get strength three, clear out Ganon's OGC, find Mirror Shield. They'll know they can go back to Spirit. Ben Kenpachi Corbin. and Renata are probably only like a Ganon's castle apart. Because Kenpachi's already yeah. done most of Adult Spirit, so they can just rush to the Mirror Shield checks. That's true. I was wondering who I saw do that. Uh, what is that? In the chat. It's it looks like a uh, picture of adult Link. Okay, I was like <laughs> actually thrown off by that. I was like uh... I clicked it so you don't have to. It's just a <laughs> image of adult Link. Okay. All right, strength three for Kenpachi. So which chest are you feeling Dins is on? I'm feeling... Twin Rova. It's got to be Twin Rova. Yeah. Wouldn't, wouldn't have it. it any other way. I'm going to do the top of spirit one. Shield backflip room. Yep, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what it's called, but you know. Top of spirit, I do, yes. <laughs> Ooh, pretty clean clams. Room can be quite annoying. Yeah, we're... Oh yeah, four armos is what you call this one. Alright. Nope. I actually don't know what the X is for. For the channel point rewards. Do you know that one, Rogue? Renata continuing to clean out Spirit because they don't necessarily know that's Mirror Shield locked. I haven't done it here before. Kenpachi will be able to go back and skip most of these checks. Still think Renata's quite a bit in the lead, but not as much as you may think. I was just talking into my mic without push to talk for like a minute, realizing why I was like, why do you keep interrupting me? It's because no one can hear me. Cool. Okay. I thought you just walked away for a second. Nope, nope. I just forgot to press my button. I was talking <laughs> about press uh, press X to Jason. 
Um, it's from the there's there's a uh, PS3 game called Heavy Rain. Um, oh, okay. It's David Cage game, and there's a, a part in it where you're yelling for your child named Jason, and every time you press X, your guy goes Jason. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. It was so you have related to that. You press X to Jason, <laughs> or Sean, yeah. And yes, in LA Noir, it's press X to doubt. Okay. And in Call of Duty, it's press F to pay respects. Yeah. I haven't played those games. I just know the memes. Yeah. But like, I think like out of context. I did play L.A. Noir. L.A. Noir was very fun for, uh, especially for the technology of its day. Yeah. Cod mod too. Chats. That's true. Well, we got it hinted. You mean in water? No, oh, sorry for spirit. Oh yeah, good point. Yeah, they're gonna look at it. That's not gonna that be one. it, but yeah, I was just mentioning. It's like they don't know. They haven't been to Spirit yet, so they're just doing everything. Huff Puff with the raid of three. Welcome in. Catching us towards the end of this pretty quick seed. I don't think there's been anything that's really cruel besides well, Valley being required. Yeah. That's gonna bite Ven Corbin. I think we're. I think that's gonna spell the end of their tournament at this point. I'm gonna feel too bad about losing that. That's a. It's a tough beat. Yeah. Skipping Valley is not a very weird thing to choose to skip. Just, just so happens that sometimes that happens. That there is an item there. So, so this is why they uh, mm -hmm. put in the um, the scarecrow, so they could get that easier. So it really was Twin Rova. <laughs> oh yeah, gotta be. Yeah, I checked their mini map, and the chest was open, so they didn't forget it. How long a full Ganons took to clear? <laughs> the scale and lens. No, we had not seen Lab Dive. Yeah, because, yeah. I knew there was a reason. <laughs> Twin Rova has to be Dins. Which will just take us to the ability full to go clear here. Yeah, full clear of a foolish shadow. Hmm. Or there's a back. Can they skip the back of shadow? Because that's always nice when it's like, you're go moding. Here's all the keys. You can skip the back of shadow. It's so rare. Yeah. Yeah. Once I had it, it was so nice. Like, I even was able to skip the... Invisible chest, Redead's room. Like, I had like all the keys in boss key by the hookshot target's room, and I was just like, okay. Yeah, yeah, I've had that kind of seat exactly one time. And Corbin doing long strut strats across the hands. Okay, so this is going to be interesting to see what Ven Corbin chooses to do. His best bet would have been a reverse there. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Do that and then peek it and get it with long shot. Is that what you were thinking, Rogue? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Just any way to get to the valley at this point. Yeah. See, if strength had been in GTG, Corbin would be so far ahead. Yeah, absolutely. Or Mirror Shield was there instead, yeah. This looks like they're going back, child. Which could wind up with a valley play. Yeah. I can't see them going back for, like, a child three. And then choosing to skip valley again. Unless they're just committed to last locationing valley. Oh, they're checking the uh, big po. Oh, fair enough. Which, oh my god, if that brings them back up to the mountain... Watch, watch them Bolero straight out of here. Yeah. All right, time to see. No, don't actually do it. I was joking. Oh. This is the, what happens. Yeah. yeah when you're, yep. There it is. That is a go mode for Renata. Why even sit through this cutscene? Just Nocturne out of the room. It's just muscle memory, I guess. Yeah, I know, for sure. So that's a Zora Sapphire for, uh, for Renata. And yeah, they gotta know they're ready to go. Oh, they might not have been too burning cack yet. Yeah. That's Renata Dunice. That is a good question. I'm wondering if that's... I just hope they don't get baited into something silly. Oh, Kenpachi did not do these checks either. Okay. Yeah, the Dins is, and it's not even that bad because it is hinted, Spirit is hinted, and there was nothing else ambiguous about it. Yeah. Yep, a lot of the seed was just doing your progression and then figuring out when to work in those Waths. But that Valley Strength is the linchpin. Yeah. Three runners went there pretty early. And one of them did not. <laughs> yeah. I guess this is the... How you learn to be like, yeah, do valley. Or at least give you the awareness that it can punish. It's a shame that it happens in a uh, elimination match. Yeah. Yeah, I was just saying, it's like, I would not feel too bad. That's, I'd just be like, eh, yeah, it was Valley. Don't, don't turn, oh. All right, Renata is the first of our runners to make it inside the Shadow Temple. Hopefully it's a nice quick one for them. And then we can uh, get, get to pig stabbing. Yeah, this is looking like a Sub three for Renata. I think I said that a while ago. If you follow yeah. all your breadcrumbs, you should be able to sub three this. Yeah. Okay, yep. One of our trackers is just a little bit behind on the... Okay, yep, it's got updated.
Was Zelda <laughs> Oh, come on! <laughs> that joke. I'm so mad. I like stupid jokes, and even I'm cringing. <laughs> Renaz got a straight line to the finish. Kenpachi's just a little bit behind. Yeah, this is gonna come down to execution in our uh, Nocturne winner's bracket match. But they both have this seed figured out. They're gonna get Dins on Twin Rova. And I believe they already have Nocturne. Am I correct in this? I don't remember. Maybe. <laughs> that saves a little bit of time. Okay, Dylan does not yet. Okay. We've got a triple spirit going on. Three Spirits in a Shadow, which is uh, the sequel to Four Weddings and a Funeral. Yeah. So focusing on the Dylan and Corbin race, what do they still need? They're looking for the Dins. Yeah, uh, Dylan's gonna pick it up in this um, in yeah. this uh, uh, this Trap. dip here, um, and Corbin just needs to get to the valley. Yeah. That's as much as we can say about it, unfortunately. They're gonna find out that they're child locked here. They might climb at this yeah. point. Yeah, I just hope you get the Waff here in spirit until they learn it's me or shield locked. And then I guess it's just a guessing game for Corbin for me or shield. <laughs> that is also <laughs> that is also a good call. Uh -huh. Oh, we can see long shot strats over to the spirit other hand. And yeah, Corbin's gonna climb his child. They're really hoping that uh, it's not something that's mirror locked, and that's that's not going to work out for them today, unfortunately. Yeah, I dread to think what this is like a point where it's like you might end up going Stone Jabu. Now, what's what's Kenpachi doing here? Oh, I just looked at. They okay. They're okay. They got. Um, that's right. They they just beat Twin Roba, right? They've got Dins. Kenpachi does. Uh, it's not updated on their tracker. Right, but they definitely they're not in spirit anymore, and we made the three spirits in the. Okay, yes, they definitely have it. So they're just going and getting their um, burning cack song, and then they'll be into shadow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't have any control over the puns. I'm not the mod here. Yeah, the best we can do is what we've been doing, which is ignore them. Songs are hard. There we go. So Kenpachi is going to join Renata in Shadow Temple. We'll see if yeah. they can make up the ground at all. Yeah, it's... It's definitely a sizable lead. Where is Kipachi going now, though? Yeah, that's a good question. 
What are they? Why wouldn't you just? Are they trying to get the song out of the Temple of Time first. That's the only thing I could think of, but it, it's not even Prelude. It's so. yeah. Why would you? Mm. Maybe they didn't get the Prelude hint. Maybe they're just hoping that this is gonna be Prelude. Yeah. In which case, I don't see why it's any faster or slower to do this first, even if... Yeah. I'm... Well, you can warp right back. Yeah. That's still not something I would do when that's all... I mean, I guess if you don't know that Prelude's on the Ocarina and you're, you're trying to get yourself set up for what to do right when you finish, yeah, you find out it's Serenade and then you get bummed and you're like, okay, fine. Where? He's got not a lot. Dins. Not a lot. He's got Nocturne. I hope they didn't like miss Mark. He's got magic. They haven't like miss marked their dungeons or something, have they? Yeah, do they think it's Jabu? Corbin is going to do Jabu as well. I'm, and they're locked in too. Why are we doing Richard right now? Did we mess up the stone distribution on Restream? N no. Yeah, okay. I know it went really fast at the start, so I was like, but if it was Jabba, they would have done that earlier. For sure. What does he think he's missing? He's got everything to do Shadow. Oh. They have personally, on their own track, are mismarked. That's the only thing I can think of. Well, this is this is actually a good thing because he's gonna find bigger ones. But yeah, no, Renata is just running further and further away with it now. Yeah, I, I can't offer any more insight in this. I just don't know. St uh, a strength upgrade was in Gerudo Valley. And that is what Van Corbin is missing because um, Mirror Shield is strength three locked in OGC. Yep. ZD checks. Yeah. I, I, well, here's. I've definitely got questions now. Yeah. Meanwhile, Renata about halfway through Shadow at the moment. Um, see how Dylan does on their Twin Rova. Unless they actually did quick skip Twin Rova. I don't know about that. How you doing, Vigi oh. James? Because Goombill just said they skipped. They don't have Dins marked on their personal tracker. Oh, do you think they didn't turn around and check the item? Like they beat Twin Rova and left? I would feel so bad about that. That would be so bad. I wonder what they think the way the hero item was, though. Zora Tunic, maybe. Yeah, if they don't remember. 
We're trying to figure that out, Felix. We're at a bit of a loss. Regarding that. Okay, just picking up random checks at the moment. Yeah, maybe just we'll learn where Ferraris is, though. Yeah. Alright. Going to time. Corbin's just in a hunt for Mirror Shield, which is Lock Mine Strength 3 and. I thought they were gonna walk out into the field and go. Oh, we're he left before doing Twin Rova. Lord, the platform didn't melt the face. What are you doing, man? Yeah, they must think it's just the Zora tunic. Not remembering that they have both wallets are accessible. This is a lesson in understanding the logic. It's important. Yeah. I, I don't blame you <laughs> for just assuming Dins. All right, we've got a bongo coming up for Renata. No ice arrows, though, so this is going to be a tough one. Oh, uh, yeah, it's not even logic. Wouldn't that be great if there are settings that just. It's like, oh, required okay. ice arrows. <laughs> yeah. What is this Majora's Mask? Yeah. Just put arbitrary like logic requirements. I think this might be our last chance to cat jam to the ice cap zone. Yeah. Probably. It's some off-brand aftermarket version of Ocarina of Time video. <laughs> like the great value brand. <laughs> I guess no name. Oh. It's like got a yellow box and just says a Zelda game yeah. on it. Even if they're behind and not going to win, it's still very unfortunate to see. Oh, they haven't done child side, so they just assumed it. Well, if they assumed it was child side, they would have come here first. Yep, a double race. Got a map Same seed, on the... thankfully. Can you imagine if they were doing two separate seeds? I would have uh, backed out of comms. I I couldn't. Double is already very tricky. This is fun though. We did get a lot of divergence, like we were hoping. Yeah. The only thing similar was they did do. Everyone did. Pretty long childs. I think Dark Dylan did an extremely long child, like almost an hour. Yeah, Dylan was definitely the last one to pull up the sword. Poor Ben Corbin still searching. Twitch goblin, goblin up all your twitches. <laughs> that got me off guard. 
Yes, this is. They're both racing the same seat. Just two different 1v1 races, just being featured at the same time. And for restream purposes, they're given the same seed. Yep. Um, the top two racers are in the winner's bracket of the Nocturne division, uh, winner's bracket round two. And the uh, bottom two racers are in the lower bracket of the Requiem division in uh, round one of the lower bracket. So then Corbin, unfortunately, is probably going to be out of the tournament after the uh, after uh, loot missing out on strength in the valley. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're just desperately. It's extra brutal because it's a really rough mirror shield location in a pretty otherwise jetty seed. So they have a ton of options to just be looking for mirror shield. And it just so happens to be somewhere pretty nasty. Yeah, that everyone else has checked. Yeah. Renata gets his uh, Ganon's Castle boss key, and he is off to the races. Poor Kinpachi probably feels real bad about not finding anything in the rest of Spirit. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's real sad face. Yeah, e exactly. As I was saying, it's not like the weirdest thing to be like missing. It's completely understandable. Corbin double checking the bottom of the lake. Actually, this is his first time here. Because their their first time here, excuse me. They um they got their long shot as child. Oh yeah, that's right. And that. So, yeah, it's. I would go ice before valley. <laughs> like this late, yeah. I do appreciate the commitment though, because it's one of those. Like, Things that's like I skipped Valley. If it's Valley, I already lost. So. Yep. Yep. I completely understand doing this. And yeah, this is interesting. Shadow Temple. Not very Shadow Temple-y. Ominous is not oh, what I would describe the music as. Didn't melt the face, so he's got to go up and around. I actually learned that the hard way recently. And then I was like, okay. So I was just going to follow away the hero. and the... I don't remember why I bailed and then was going to come back. I learned the hard way. Yeah, triumphant shadow town. I guess it fits in the context of being go mode. Yeah, for real. Renata getting bodied by the uh, the iron knuckles here. Lucky to have found those titties earlier. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> nice backflip to get out of the way of that one. All right, and we're through. Let's see if uh, Renata can do the one cycle of Ganondorf with the Master Sword. I still think they've got a sub three, even if it's not the cleanest. It's going to be close, I think. It depends on uh, what they can do with the Master Sword here. Yeah. Glad Kenpot is at least finding the mirror shield, though I'm not sure. You mean Dins? Yeah. Yeah, it's it's poor, it's Ven Corbin who's never gonna find that mirror shield. Yeah. 
He's, we're not, uh, Kimpachi also struggling with the uh, iron knuckle here. Let's see if he's got the rhythm. A little too slow. Yeah. Not the easiest Ooh, thing in the world. And a little slow on the. Uh, oh no! And he knocked down the the block. I get. It. Especially when you're at the end of the race and you're like, I might win, but the you don't know. The nerves are real. <laughs> Like, for all you know, you're, like, 10 seconds behind or something. Yeah, you, you're, you've got one eye on the race time room. Is he going to dot done before me? Yeah. So I think we've all seen that, where it's, like, where you get sniped by, like, five seconds in a race. It's painful. Yeah. And it's just like, if I would have just done Ganon or Ganondorf a little better. You start to think about the little time losses that you had throughout the whole course yeah. of a three hour seed. Start to regret each and every one and then go into a shame spiral and then yeah. I mean uh, never mind. Oh no, I agree. <laughs> I'm totally minding. I wonder what Corbin has left in the game. Yeah, that's a good question. F deep fire? Do you think they go to deep fire before doing the valley? I think they would go back to GTG for the push block and oh, yeah. try to do adult valley at the same time. Ven Corbin uh, uses they, them, Bitsy, just for a heads up. Renata on to the final phase of Ganon as Kenpachi. He yeah, finishes off to Monrova. Uh, he's, he's gonna, gonna he's gonna see the GG. He's gonna see the dot done while he's in the uh, cutscene here. Oh, that feels real bad to to realize that Dins is there after after leaving Spirit. I, I felt that the, the like standing there for like one second contemplating your choices. And Renata is uh, is gonna get the sub three here. Uh, Zelda laying down laying down the track. Laying down a beat, and uh, Link's about to finish off Ganondorf here. Cut up off, cut, yeah, cut us off some bacon. Oh, oh, swing, swing, and there we go. GG's Renata. They have uh, they have won this winners bracket matchup. <clears throat> Just as Kenpachi goes to open Shadow Temple, so we'll see if they see it. Oh, and, come on, uh, it's... Yep, they're seeing it. They're done. We'll see if uh, Renata and Kenpachi want to come in for a uh, for an interview. Yeah. Um, and in the meantime, we watch Dark Dylan finish up Shadow Temple and uh, and send yeah. Ven Corbin packing from the Scrubs tournament. I wonder if Corbin will get the strength before the end. Yeah, it looks like. It looks like they might be heading there now. I don't know. I don't know where Renata's from. I do not know these runners, unfortunately. There's, there's a lot of people in the community. Really cool. People from all over the world joining to play this 90s game in a different way. Gotta love it. It's beautiful. Oh no, Dylan! Oh, 
Dylan just has to has to fall off the uh, the boat like five or six more times, and Corbin might have a chance. Ah, uh, it's North America. Okay. Okay, Kimpachi has decided not to come in, but Renata will be in. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, no, I understand. <laughs> Nerves in a 1v1 oh, race. It's, you're in go mode. You've got to stay like you literally can't do anything to make it go faster right there. It's an auto scroller. It's It's got to feel it's definitely makes you feel shaky because yeah, it's one of those things that's like I've had scenes where it's like I could be 10 minutes ahead. I could be 10 minutes behind. I could be tied. I have no idea. Um, looks like we've got Renata in the waiting room here. Okay. Hello, GG's Renata. Congratulations on your victory. How do you feel? <laughs> I've honestly been expecting to lose any second for about the last two hours after that yeah. full fight. So <laughs> it was you were a bit ahead towards the end, but uh, the big thing was uh, your opponent didn't do Twin Rova. They bailed. Oh, I'm not sure exactly what the logic was. If they misread the tunic. Maybe I'm not sure if they saw the other uh, wallet. So, oh, uh, yeah, that would make sense then. Yeah, they had already done an early adult dip into oh. the spirit, and then they did a spirit too after Mirror Shield. Did like two uh, more decks, and then cleaned up everything except Twin Roba, and then left. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah. And then no, they were um, about to... Sorry. I was just going to say, you were concerned about the Volvagia uh, fight that you had. Um, <laughs> but yeah. you, uh, your opponent uh, died to Phantom Ganon a couple of times, and you were able to make oh. up the uh, the time with a decent Phantom Ganon. So. <laughs> Skin of my teeth on that one, too. Everyone had... <laughs> that was close. That was very close, yes. This was a Who Needs Health seed. Yeah, very, very unhealthy yeah. seed. Like, I swear, at like an hour in, everyone had like five or six hearts. It was like <laughs> ridiculous. Wow. Well, at least it wasn't just me then. <laughs> yep. Oh, no. I think we saw a death from like almost everyone. At least yeah. three players died at some point. And Dark Dylan has gotten his sixth medallion, and he's going to be uh, uh, getting the boss key and uh, moving on. Ven Corbin still avoiding the valley like the plague. Yep. That strength three, that strength in the valley with, uh, with mirror shield on OGC. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. no, a deep fire play. This feels so bad. So for not, do you I have any that... comments about this seed? Oh, <laughs> with that Kokiri forest start, I figured I'm just going full boomer on this one, and <laughs> that paid out, I guess. In the yeah. Deku tree to valley, and then yeah, yeah, I'm. Uh... Happy to uh, have sub three this, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, Only Bitsy's like... in chat saying every seed can sub three. <laughs> yeah, if you have the spoiler log, yeah. <laughs> I bet you can. Yeah. You must have been pretty happy about that mirror shield being like, oh, I would have missed yeah. this if I didn't have strength three. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, just the whole way of the thing, like, the seed just flowed, uh, <laughs> like, in my favor the entire time, I guess. Like, I just did progression and nothing else, and... Yeah, that's just do progression forehead. Yeah. It's it's a, um, it's definitely a seed that, we, we, at the 45-minute mark, we were missing two items and had two unresolved ways of the hero. <laughs> and 
um, it was just one of those things where you just follow the breadcrumbs that the seed gives you, yeah, and you do it. But um, only if you went to the valley. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And uh, Van Corbin unfortunately is gonna end up out of the tournament because they skipped the valley. Oh, that's too bad. And uh, Ken Kenpachi, of course, just falls to the lower bracket of the Nocturne Division. Their uh, tournament is not over. And uh, Renata, you move on to, um, what is this, round three in the winner's side? Yeah, I was not expecting that. <laughs> but Congratulations. Yeah, that feels good. Thanks. So how are you feeling pretty early on when there was quite a bit of items early on with a lot open? Yeah, it was a pretty generous seed early on, yeah. um, which, yeah, that's like, like, <laughs> like I was saying, I was going to go full boomer on it and do like Dodongos, but there was so much else to do that <laughs> I had to delay it a bit. I think Dylan just realized they left the key in the temple. Oh. Which has to feel terrible right now, not knowing where your opponent is. Like, they, they don't know that they're far and away out in front, but... Right. And no prelude, like... Feels <laughs> real bad. Yeah. yeah, that was another interesting thing that... Every single, all four players decided to do Pretty Long Childs, like 40 plus minutes. Yeah, Which the fewer age changes you're doing now, the better. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, especially when you're like, okay, it's prelude, so I'm not going to have quick changes. Might as well just do as much child as I can and not have to worry about it later. Yeah, that's the new update where you just get boss key after you beat your last dungeon. Ooh, okay, I like that. I didn't know that was coming. Yeah, that's like in the dev build. It fixes the thing where you can scum it away too, right? Yeah, unless you like... Unless you beat a dungeon, frame perfectly, pause, and then save quit. Yeah, because you would definitely do that. <laughs> I once, like, did, like, a million warps and then just, like, got my boss key delivered to me when I was in Ganon's because I just, like, instantly played a song, like, hookshot it into Forest and then Forest Wind back into Ganon's, like, super fast. It was weird. Alright, Dark Dylan's gonna be finishing up here pretty start soon. Yeah. Seems Corbin just committed to just never doing Valley. Yep. Which I guess if you don't do it early, that's one of those things you just commit to not doing in a 1v1. Being like, that's what my time save is going to be, not doing Valley. Oh, it does check every frame? Interesting, okay. Okay, um, did we have a, a match yesterday, Adam versus Can Maple? Did that happen? Not up to date on all the matches, so I can't help you there. Is there anything else you wanted to add, Renata? No, I think that's about it. I guess I'll head out. Yeah, I'm not trying to kick you out. I just wanted to. <laughs> well, I was about to um, keep I commentary just, going if you didn't. I was have just trying to check in because the winner of that match is who um, Renata has in the next round. So I was going to start a conversation based on that. Uh, okay. But I didn't know who won yesterday's match. I think it was Adam. So. Yeah, do you know anything about either of those runners? Do you have any feelings about the next round? <laughs> uh, no, I've kind of been doing my uh, scouting pretty uh, last minute, <laughs> so 
Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it, though. Never yeah. matter. Just do all your checks really fast. Win. Yeah, yeah. Just do the checks <laughs> with the items. And uh, I imagine that means that... Um... Oh, yeah. Oh, well, that makes sense. Dylan never got light arrows. Must be Miss Matt. Miss... Uh, blah, blah. Miss tracked. Right. So they've got to do... Uh, I... Okay, so it's nighttime. They don't know that it's... <laughs> they, they might be afraid that it's chicken. But they're going to get it right here when they do... Uh... Yeah. Uh, archery. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. We had that super early. They were first. Play. Okay, that's right. Hope Corbin isn't too upset if they come in for an interview. No, no Frozen Wind or Prelude at all this seed. We don't even know where they, where FW is. Yeah, it must be in the well. It actually, actually can't can because it's foolish, right? Yeah, can't yeah. There. So it's like gotta be like deep Jabu. Fire. Okay, yeah. Job. It's in Jabu? Okay, that makes sense. Well, we don't know that for sure, but... That's actually the most sensible thing. Okay. This really shows how annoying not having Prelude is. It's like, okay. I got light arrows. Okay, I want to go back to Ganon's walk. Yeah, it... Yeah. Oh, Corbin hoping against hope that it's up here in Highest Goron. Or this is for our swim. Yeah, at least you don't have to do the gauntlet again. You just go straight up. This layout leaves a an item on the, the hammer chest, so unfortunately he's going to go do that. They're, they're going to go do that. Makes sense. I like to sometimes skip it when I'm like, I only need one item left in the game. It's really situational for me, whether I do Pious Goron or Hammer Chest first. Oh yeah. I'm at the most nervous fighting Ganondorf. And I just always choke. Corbin, like, throw a bomb at it? I think that's what they're doing, yeah. That's an interesting strat. I didn't know you could even do that. I thought the intended strategy was hookshot. Learn something new, I guess. Yeah, I, I would have never defeated you with the light arrows from Kak if you didn't tell me. Can you imagine randomizer if that hint didn't exist? Oh my god. And, yeah, casino mode in every other seat. Not that it isn't that already. It's pretty early because every, as long as I've played randomizer, and the hint. Now, Dylan and Corbin both have the uh, bigger on sword, so much easier one cycle. Yeah.
Yeah, Hammer's obviously the fastest. Can you imagine getting Ferraris there and thinking it for half a second that it's Din's and then the pure heartbreak? You just see the shape and then your brain processes the color. Lake. This has to be adult. This has to be Valley for Corbin, right? Yeah, yeah, uh, assuming they got the Lake Foolish hint. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Okay, just get in the horse. Luckily, you know, mercifully, they're gonna see the dot done before they get out there. Yeah. Yeah, it can't because there's a logic for it to get a skull in Water Temple. Logic that you're never gonna end up using, but it's logic. Yeah, the chances of that are astronomically low. Yeah. The only time I could like, see it happening within any reason is like a skull sanity seed. There's zero in scrubs, yeah. Alright, maybe Corbin is gonna see it before the dot done. Oh no, maybe they're gonna see it at the dot done. I don't know, because it's in the vault. They're gonna be at like the crate when they're done. Oh, no, they're going back into oh, GTG. Oh my god. Oh, poor guy. Poor, poor, poor Ben Corbin. And there's the final stab by Dark Dylan. Dylan is moving yeah. on to round two of the loser's bracket. And Corbin just saw the dot done. Pat's opponent a couple of times. We did good, kid. But uh, that's, all, that's all they wrote. We'll see if either of them would like to step in for an interview. But yeah, GG's up. Yeah. That was a fun one to watch. Even when players were doing dungeons, they were doing different dungeons at different times. No quad for us this time. Yeah, we managed to yeah. avoid that. <laughs> yeah, we had tri-spirit at most. Three spirits in a shadow. Yeah. GG. GG's welcome in, Ven Corbin. Uh, I uh, very sorry to break it to you. Have you have you been told where your strength, where where your items were yet? Uh, no. Well, so yes, but no. Uh, I found out that Din's was outside Ganon's castle, which were which means I needed strength three. So I don't know where strength three was either. Strength three was the Valley Waterfall. You know, I felt like I I missed something in my original routing. Um, it was it was tough. That was um, oh, so that's a just, really tough beat. So it you, didn't come to mind, or were you intentionally skipping it? No. So actually, you know, when I went over the bridge right there at the very end, I was like, you know, I never did box and waterfall. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Like, I, think I, I think I got the hint that Lake Hylia was foolish, and I was like, well, I'm not gonna go all the way south for nothing, and. Yeah. Wound up being the game changer. GG's yeah. Dark Dylan, yeah. welcome in. Congratulations. Yeah. Moving on to the next round of the lower bracket in uh, in Requiem. Yep. Yeah, it's just one of those things where doing Valley and Child One just paid off. Yeah, definitely. That's trying for Grado. <laughs> uh. It's a real yeah. That that's a really ugly. Everything else in that seed was very jet. Um, it was handed to you right away, and you had the breadcrumbs to follow, but only if you did Valley. 
No, yeah. pretty, pretty much. All right, well, I just wanted to stop in and say thanks for having me in the tournament and stuff like that. I'm going to bounce and go get some food and stuff, so. Absolutely. I understand for racing, and thanks for giving us a good time. All right. Yep, GG's. All right, uh, Dylan, hey. you're still alive in the tournament. You're going to be facing the, the loser of the T Gren Grenadier uh, Sinja match. Uh, do you know anything about those runners? Do you have any um, idea of how, how any feelings about how you're, you're going to feel the rest of the tournament? Honestly, not really. Like, I'll just play my game as I usually do. Focus a lot of sc on skull riding. Yeah. Yeah, this was a lucky seed for that. No 30, no 20. Mm -hmm. I, I, yeah. I, I want 20 or 30 seeds. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Yeah, there's two types of players. Those who feel rewarded for finally routing skulls and those who feel punished for not doing skulls. <laughs> right. I am the latter. Yeah. <laughs> so, I'm yeah, person who, who checks like 20 skulls at two and a half hours in. I'm that kind of person. Yep. Yeah, I... I like every time I did like multi worlds with friends, uh, we have like nearly all sanity on except for like key sanity. So skull mm -hmm. routing becomes a lot like a really important at that point. Uh, yeah. Mostly scrubs though. When I'm like twenty minutes in, I know ten is the most I have to do. Then I really want to slack. I really have to uh, hold myself back, like just running out <laughs> past every skull. It's like I want to grab it. Like <laughs> <laughs> That's understandable. Uh, did you have any specific comments about this seed? Did you feel it was hard, difficult, or pretty easy and straightforward? It was pretty straightforward. It's like also a lot of... My early on, not really that many safety health. Like, uh, obviously I died in mm. the forest, like at the bow yeah. chest. That's I could, uh, oh, I could good, I'm easily. not the only one. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. It's like I, I had the, the red potion, I'm like, I don't want to drink it, so it's... Like, this is not difficult, and then I get jump slashed. <laughs> yeah. It's like, a tough uh, one. Like that, yeah, that we saw a lot of deaths this scene. Like, that like, really felt, felt bad, yeah. yeah Nobody no, had no more health. than six hearts until, like, an hour and a half. Yeah, it's so like, until you go to, like, Gannis Castle, and you get double defense, uh, a lot of hearts. Yeah. There's gotta be, like, four heart containers in well or something. <laughs> Probably, yeah. <laughs> like, a lot of uh, heart pieces. Yeah. There's like uh, also that Din's fire at the Twin Rover. It's like I, oh, yeah. I entered that like my last wave to hero hint. I can't remember what actually the, what the, the wave to hero was in Kakariko. I think it ended up being Nocturne on Burning Cac. Yeah. Oh, right. Or uh, if not that, Fire Arrows for some sort of logic and spirit. No. It's like I, I got the Cac and I'm like, oh, what did I didn't do in Cac yet? What did I get? But then it's like, uh, it's like Spirit Temple was my last wave to hero. I'm like, okay, it has to be here. Like, this fight has yeah. to be here. And then I get uh, the scale upgrade. I'm like, yeah. no, this doesn't make sense. Were you nervous at all when you saw the Zara tunic? Or did you remember that you had both wallets? Uh, I didn't I didn't really think much about the, the Zara tunic. It's like, it's like, I don't know if that even can be a wave to hero uh, item. It could be if like boss keys in the central pillar. Okay, I didn't know that, so... Yeah, like... I think that's the only <laughs> check in water that yeah. it's required for in yeah. these settings. Okay, like, I didn't know that yet, so... Thankfully, I didn't know that. <laughs> you will once you experience Water Temple Way the Hero and it's just a Zora tunic because your other wallet is in Out of Logic Forest. Oh, that sounds horrible. <laughs> that's like, that didn't, like... I literally was running through Spare Temple just thinking, it's like, I want to bail, but... <laughs> Literally, Zora's tunic doesn't make sense, neither does yeah. scale, considering I got like, well, like, first item was, off, uh, was Iron Boots. Yeah, yeah, you had Iron Boots and Lake was dead. Yeah, so it's like, like, what is, uh, what can logically require yeah. uh, gold scales, like only Lumi yeah. Tree, but I already checked yeah. that, and what, at least at the time it was a Yeah, and you had Bomb Bag, so you had access to Domain, there was nothing that yeah. scale locked at all. So it's like, this doesn't make sense, I'll just keep going. It's like, then the, yeah. it, like, the, uh, the light chest and yeah. uh, what is it? Yeah. Like, uh, on top of uh, Spirit Temple. Can't speak yeah. anymore. And it's like, nothing. It's like, uh, fine, I'll kill Twin Rover. Yeah. At least it was unambiguous. Like, 
Okay, I've done everything in spirit except Twin Rova and don't have a way of the hero. I guess it's Twin Rova. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Would have been brutal if it was like, <laughs> like Longshot was there too. Oh, it's like uh, it was, I think Longshot was in the uh, Sora's Fountain. Yeah, yeah and the, uh, the fairy. And like, oh, okay, good. That, that actually makes me happy. Mm -hmm. I can just go to Water Temple and uh, get uh, like get whatever I need. <laughs> like not having Longshot is like the worst feeling ever for the longest time. Yeah. Nothing of worth in GTG, we noticed. I didn't even visit. <laughs> yeah, no, that that's one of the reasons I think that uh, you won. Um, then Corbin did, in fact, dip GTG really early, which you had the full kit for it really early, but you also had all this progression to do instead, so it's a pretty big gamble. It's like, uh, it's like I think I was actually considering it when I first went to uh, Desert Colossus, like with uh, Requiem. Yeah, I'm like uh, it's like I'm good. It's like no, never mind. Like, like yeah, if it's nothing, it's like there's still plenty of chances. Uh, it's simply nothing, or I'm still missing a, a foolish end. Yeah, but I never got the all five way of the heroes and all three uh, foolishes. Like I, I had bottom of the well lake highly ever foolish. No idea what the last one was. I don't, I don't remember seeing a third foolish. But I also, you know, it's tough paying attention to all the things. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Well and Lake are two pretty strong ones. Actually, to think when you think about it. Yeah. For sure. I got Lake. I got Lake. I go for. Yeah, Lake and No with No Serenade is a really good foolish. I hate the reverse way the hero Lake and then you just don't get Serenade or Scale and you're just like, really? Oh, I saw I saw the big one, saw the that's a Rudus <laughs> letter. I'm like, I'm I'm going I'm going going back, and then I get scared. Like, yeah, okay, I'm gonna write this in. <laughs> like this early, it just saves for way too much time. All right. Did you have any closing thoughts that you wanted to share with us? Uh, not really. Like this was pretty generous in our, in all accounts. Yeah, it's pretty much just the mirror shield being a <laughs> potentially inconvenient location. But yeah. if you did Valley before Ganon's, it wasn't. Yeah, pretty much. All right, so I think I think we're about to um, wrap up here. So let's let's give uh, some final shouts out um, for our our runners. Uh, Shout out to Kenpachi and Renata in the Nocturne Division match and Dark Dylan and Ven Corbin in the Requiem Division match. <clears throat> Shout out to our trackers, Melqui, Goombill, Lee Harold, and Goldfish. And a shout out to my co-commentator, Purple Rupees, for hanging out with me today. For sure. Thanks for having us on Raystream. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. And uh, shout out to Jimbo for the uh, for the restream. Shout out to Goldfish and Bitsy for doing race mods. And uh, and yeah, I've been Rogue Copter. Yep. Thanks for having me. Hope to possibly volunteer again in the near future. Have a good one, everyone. Thanks. You too. All right, thanks again to all of our volunteers today for uh, joining us for that double feature restream. Uh, we really appreciate you all coming out and supporting the Scrubs tournament. Uh, again, big thanks to all the volunteers. Thanks to the runners. Thanks to chat for tuning in. Let's take a look at our schedule. Uh, it looks like our next match for the tournament is going to be October 11th. So tomorrow at uh, 11 a.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. GMT. Uh, looks like actually we have a match every day uh for the next four days with uh, the respected times on stream you can get these uh times from our discord uh by going to discord.gg scrub central and joining that all tournament information will be posted in there you could also view the schedule at scrubs.zeldaspeedruns.com to uh get updates on the latest uh tournament matches coming up um we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna raid Send a raid over to AK uh, Sanyi. I hope I didn't butcher that name. If I did, I apologize. Uh, they are currently doing a No Logic tournament practice seed. So 
head over there show some love no spoilers and uh thanks again for coming out everyone we will see you next time okay rest of your day